And it goes without saying, the one and the only, the, lon- the loneliness man in Nairobi. The one and the, one and the lonely. The one and the lonely. <laughs> Episode title done. Over 26. This is the Fag of Podcast. This is the Brunch Club. Over 26. Welcome back to the Mike's Art Club. Now, when you watch it, you'll understand. What up, my name is Chaxi V, Mastermind, your main guy, V, Lord Chaxi, the beautiful Mariah is around, the amazing Moss is around, the whole gang is around, episode 68, we are matching! <laughs> and it goes without saying, the one and the only, the, lon- the loneliness man in Nairobi. <laughs> the, one and the one and the lonely. The one and the lonely. <laughs> episode title done. The one and the lonely, episode title. <laughs> Goofy's in the building! <laughs> <laughs> ah, scare. Mimi, I have so much for Goofy. But before, 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 before Mimi ni answer, just before, before I start. Mkianza mbaya mbaya, I'm walking out. <laughs> That's why. Yeah, right. you, you, you'll be the first person who's, who've ever walked out of this set. It look, I uh, mean, I've walked out before. <laughs> <laughs> then you came back. Yeah, then you came back. It took a couple of episodes of Jerry Springer. It took a couple of cameras. <laughs> Even when you get into your car, when you come to back, you go back all the way back. Ah, mm. uh, can we begin mm-hmm. by rating bars? Yes, Ooh. and also by rating bars. Just before we rate our own bars, right? Mm-hmm. I want us to rate Calligraph John's bars. Okay. okay. Do you know why? Yes. He jumped into the too easy, which is like the biggest song in the country now. Yeah. BMS, yeah. You know? yeah. Yeah. Have you guys heard his bars? Yeah. Ah, I, I, yeah. I, I think I you know, maybe uh, for, for a bit of context for anyone who doesn't know Goofy, maybe we start with as an intro. Yeah, so yes. we, but we're getting to Goofy. Yeah. How many? No, we we're getting to Goofy. Uh-huh. We said before oh. we get into Goofy. <laughs> okay. We, re- we discuss buzz, then we go to. But part yeah. of the why we're rating buzz is because Goofy's a poet. Yeah. As such, people will find out so okay. eventually. Yeah. Oh, like was. like Let's plot in the plot. Where was a man of many hearts, so many turbans. Coming to this pole pole. Ah, so too easy. This is the calligraph version, right? Let me know what you guys think. I thought I should make an exception Cupid this time might have used the Beretta Cause all I see when I look at you is perfection I got what you what you need, I get it here for you The only thing I wouldn't do is shed a tear for you Nah, but I don't mean that I don't care for you Cause every night before I sleep I say I pray for you Too easy, can let enough form Now won't it do cheese, you can make a croissant I'll never be too busy to pick up the phone Can it cook it, do teasy, I'll leave it alone Summer hand, got look of Halligan. Take it easy before you turn me to a Taliban. I give you loving that nobody can. Ganja fever when I see you, I wanna marry one. But I see where but then I'm not in none. Cause you make it easy for me than anybody can. Easy. Gaji honey bun. Lip stamp, nikazimiti wa asalin dan. And you don't gotta worry, hun. You mali to me talk up yan in Bali san. Shukran don't in Naritan. Cause you never show no concern about my money plan. Oh, Before to pick up the <laughs> Before you two be pull down the episode. <laughs> Fuck. Woo! That was, dope. Uh-huh. that was dope. It sounds like calligraph. Very. But that was dope. I, I have seen a money. <laughs> <laughs> Before you that, 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 that was dope, but honestly, I give it like a 7.2. Where 7.2? That's too high. Really? Yeah, I feel I feel it's okay. Too high it's it's well. a okay. very sing alongable song. I like the creativity in the last part. Yeah, is so removing Lama the last are... letter, whatever. Yeah. Mm. But it's just it's calligraph. It's. Yeah. Okay. It's 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 a that's typical right? calligraph. Yeah, song. it's that's yeah. what I'm saying. It's yeah. calligraph. A predictable like it's... flow. Uh, the cadence is the mm. same. Yeah. Um. It's 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 creative. I'm mm. not taking yeah. anything away, but. Is this a typical calligraph? It's yes. nothing new. Yeah. Okay. So but it's seven. very singular. Nah, me, I'll give him a 7.2. Mas, uh, I'll give a 6 because... 7 is for creativity. Because you're feeling generous. Point yeah. 3 is for the flow. <laughs> <laughs> no, me, I'll give him a 6 because we are about to review our own bars. <laughs> <laughs> How much, uh, what would you give him, Goofy? I'll give him a 6.5. A 6.5. Okay, yeah, okay. yeah, that's 6. decent. 5. Yeah. decent. Okay, let's see who tops Calligraph. Trend the mass. Oh, oh. Hey, back to you. So, first of all... <laughs> all right. So, in, for context... Yes. Uh, 
some of us <laughs> and the crew yeah. all wrote four bars for Goofy to review. So it's very simple, Goofy. Mm. I read the four bars, or someone has five, and then you give it out of ten. Okay. Damn. And then you guess who you think wrote those bars. <laughs> okay, <laughs> let's go. So, ya kwanza. Najua kwenda was, kwenda wax ni risky. Especially kwa umepiga glass ya whiskey. Jichonyana ni na drugs kwa system na kitu na pendanga ni mabraz na g-string. The rhyme scheme is is predictable uh-huh. so I'd, I'd give it a uh, 4.5 Guys, 4.5 because the rhyme scheme is predictable the rhyme scheme is very 4.5. predictable and it's not out of 5 out of 10 out of 10 yeah, it's okay. a 4.5 out of 10 okay. damn yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey. so OG is still talking this okay mm-hmm. so the next one this one you'll just know who it is yeah four bars because I love chocolate as it makes me goofy Guess oh. what you are? A sexy bar of goofy chocolate. Oh my God. That's <laughs> the best point you've ever made. Shut up. Come on. If you know your stuff. Gunshots. The Lord, you can't be a Oh, user. it's not over. It's not over. <laughs> oh, okay, really? okay. And okay. after, a big bar of sexy goofy chocolate. The last bar is four bars of chocolates in emojis. Creativity. So, Mariah. Because we are. Let me, let me, this, uh-huh. this. <laughs> That piece yeah. has Shakespeare shaking. Wow. <laughs> Yanni, that's the best poetry I've ever had. Okay. The bars are not predictable. Mm-hmm. The flow is there. <laughs> ah, yeah. <laughs> it's, it's, I'm still it's, waiting for the next it's, 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 it's giving. It's giving chocolates. Honestly. <laughs> <laughs> it's giving chocolates. Honestly, I'll give that a two. <laughs> But uh, that's, that's... And that's only a two because I know you. Yeah. <laughs> and I love you. <laughs> but, but, but guys, 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 guys. Listen. I was the one who's rating. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. Uh, I, I, give it, uh, I give it a 9.5. Wow! Just because she called you a goofy bar of chocolate. <laughs> yeah, that's me. What does that even mean? No, but I've never when, had chocolate when... and be like... It's <laughs> a goofy bar. Yes, 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 yes here's the other thing. The, the, flow, the flow is not linear. Like this, okay. this is a guy who is willing to explore, to go out there, to, yeah. to break the boundaries. Pesa <laughs> imemwago. <laughs> 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 okay, the last one. The second last one, actually. Niko grind comes here na suguliwa. Na ungeza do kila siku network na grow. Ni iti omolo ju graf ni kali, kazi na sherehe same day. De moja two years, same day. Maya ina itajitu kitu moja, same day. <laughs> so, hey, me as goofy <laughs> with the rating. No, definitely. You, that's a line. That's That's Moas. That's Moas. That's Moas. Actually, the the two last pieces, uh-huh. Moas. Yeah. The extra one. The extra one. Yeah. Because yeah. in a share yeah. same day, the moja two years same day. My night ajik to moja. Same day. Same day. Ah. Hey. That's, really dope. Hey. Yeah. Oh, that's dope. Let me tell you, if, if, if we hadn't, like, um, had the best poem ever. <laughs> <laughs> this would have been the one. I'd, 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 give, it, I'd give it a 9.5. But this, uh-huh. this is a mic check, yeah? Yeah. Eight. Eight. Mm. Eight. Yeah. Okay. Even the, the beginning was very nursery, though. Mm. Then it picks. Then it, it, it picks. picks. Then it picks. You have to yeah. give it's it. Like, it's like me and Jimming. I'll <laughs> pick. <laughs> pick. Pick up the weights. <laughs> <laughs> Then there's an anonymous one. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> Poetry lazima itajipa, bills lazima nitalipa. All shows paid, nothing for free. Ongeza zero after zero. This is not my red card. This is my goofy. Oof. Oh, wow. Oof. Moss is the worst yeah. fumbler ever. Uh, I know, that's ever. Oh, But that's, yo, that's, that's dope. dope. Mm. Ni, ni to me, yo. Production manager, if you're watching this, move there you know to what tickets to do. Sunday. <laughs> you know what yeah. to do. I want you know to do. I want to say the first bar was mine, yeah. but that was a scam card. I fell and I was able to get some so familiar. Dicho nyanya ni na dress ko system. Wait, what point did you give him? I didn't sing it like that. Oh my God, that's the greatest negative zero to take. Chuck said, How did you go to Bar GTP? <laughs> 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 okay, but... <laughs>
But you, you, you know, that's 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 primal cardinal. Yeah. yeah, I feel like that's primal cardinal. Yes, yeah. but this is yeah. also like a cardinal in 2014. Yeah. 2014. Yeah. So the first one was Shaxi, the bars of chocolate and sexy man. Oh, that's uh, send, and send, yeah. Yeah. send me. That's a good opener, mm. right? Yeah. Zero after zero after zero. That's my goofy. That's my goofy. That's, my goofy. that's not my record. That's Love my that. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. Hey. Who's, whose idea was it to send bars? Because I did you at all. Ajam Who did you wash? <laughs> Who? Who? Me, I feel like Kikirudi on a survey from Golilo. And if you have more objective members of the IE bus C. No, that is already disqualified. Ah, like in Goofy. Yangu masema eight, nine, nine, nine. So we're gonna seventeen. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if the math is math, then you can divide by two because it's on in Billy. Eight point five. Eight point five. Yeah, but no, but no, that's what I'm going to do. Okay, standardize. Okay, drop zero points. That's what I'm going to do. Eric, good buzz. Good buzz. Goofy. Have you been okay since Magunga got married? Yo. <laughs> It's it's one of the biggest heartbreaks I've ever had. I can imagine. Because I alianza kunia chakitambo. Like, oh, uh, Magush, I'm planning on going to Zanzibar for two two, two weeks. Uh-huh. It's like, let me ask Mama. Oh, oh that's the right. ultimate heartbreak. Uh, married people mm-hmm. or people in a relationship are the most um, annoying, rude people I know. And reliable. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yes. Anytime you're talking, <laughs> say you're talking about football and say how Manchester fumbled. At the ah, table, nah, nigga. You know, and uh, out of nowhere, I just like my wife, nah. <laughs> my, my girlfriend. Even, even my baby was saying this last night. Yeah. Shut the fuck so, up. So I'm like, I, yo, the discussion um, was about us about fumbling the league. What do you mean? Shut up. I, I make sense, but yeah, I'm, I'm healing. Yeah. Oh, I, um, I, I'm finding um, therapy. Purpose. Okay. Yeah. In this new in, journey. In yes, yes. Okay. Mm. So poetry is your plus one. Poetry is my first love. Okay. Always love. And the second? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> was Magunga, but a baby. Most wanted to know if you still have a table in your house. <laughs> <laughs> and if you have a table in your house, what's on top of it? Mm. Tables are the most irrelevant things. <laughs> in this moment. Like, tables don't make sense. I don't have a table in my house. <laughs> For what? Wow. For what? Goofy is the loneliest man in Nairobi. An <laughs> Arsenal table. fan. Yeah. I'm a Cedis fan. Uh, <laughs> hey, yo, 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 respect me. Respect hey. me. I'm not a Mercedes fan. Goofy. <laughs> Tell us about one W. It's only El Kama tattoo. Yeah. Give us I'm one a, dub. I'm a Red Bull fan. Yeah, you are actually. Yes. Yeah. Red Bull wrestling. Okay, yeah. Shout out. Um, Shout out. One W. Shout out to that. One, one W. Just one. And one. you know we're winning the rest later today. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. It's a given. It's, but yeah, I got a Red Bull for El Elm Billy. Else follow you for the rest of your life. <laughs> Give us one dub. One win. Mm. I sell out poetry shows in Kenya. Ooh. Ooh. That's something I can yes, uh, clearly say. And very few people in Kenya can actually say that. That's true. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, the person we're doing an event with called Mufasa. Mufasa. Shout yes. out to Mufasa. Yeah. I randomly oh, walked in from Mufasa in the grocery store. Uh-huh. And I think from Galina, is it you? <laughs> 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 and then he said, hello. <laughs> so that was fun. Yeah. yeah. Um, so 24th, talking about poetry shows, right? Mm-hmm. You have a poetry show coming up. Um, yeah. The title, to me, mm-hmm. was ridiculous. <laughs> Goofy wants to talk about Nairobi dating stories. <laughs> <laughs> and he's single. Then, you can get to side, I like, mm. <laughs> How? So tell us about the, uh, about the show coming up. And, um, but I, I'm personally, I'd want to know your, your funny dating stories from Nairobi. And the reason why, your character <laughs> development, the reason why. Be, being, if you're single, I manage you're not dating. Of course. Okay. Yeah, it's just that now your you're, you're, you're pool is equal, equal wide. You're very open. Yeah, you can, you, can, yeah, you can date anyone, then yeah. you, you drop them after two days, you know. Uh, because... <laughs> two days uh, the benchmark. Yeah, basically. Okay. Because you, 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 you're Wait, eating with someone. when you say date in two days, are we talking like you've taken them out yeah, yeah, and yeah, dined, yeah. you've yeah, smashed you've, yeah. and everything in between yeah. two days? Hey, so if you smash within, if you smash on the first day, you don't go to the second day, it's over. Yeah. If you Te- don't smash, you try it later. Yeah. When did this change? <laughs> oh, like two days. All three of you are in agreement. Me, I'm like. <laughs> <laughs> two days, I don't right. even know your name. Because okay. yo, the, 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 the economy is moving so fast. Yeah. We, mm. we, cannot, we don't have time to wait. Mm. Yeah, you go on a first date. Uh, naweza naweza. You <laughs> smash on the first date, Ish. so it's 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 just moving with the times in the economy. Mm. Man, Ruto is to pair time here, yeah. <laughs> second, third, fourth <laughs> date. You know? So, uh, but yeah, I'm doing a show called 
Nairobi yeah. dating stories yes. um, Mufasa. with Mufasa. So arguably, we are we are two of the biggest poets in Kenya. Just say it as you tweeted it. Don't tell me argue. Just say This is the biggest poetry show. Come on, period. You'll get the context on it. You'll get the context when you watch the previous episode. Yeah, uh-huh. We just shot it this morning. Uh, <laughs> so say it. Say it with your chest. It's the biggest poetry show in yes. in Kenya. How many people? Recent um, recent history. That's okay. like history. Um, if everything goes well, it will be um, around 800 people okay. who come to. The they buy days. the tickets over the two days. Mm-hmm. Uh, it's called Nairobi, Nairobi Dating Stories. Mm-hmm. And um, as poets, we, we talk about everything. Mm-hmm. But most of the times, artists, um, they don't tell their audience mm-hmm. that side of their, of their lives. Mm-hmm. Because it's, it's not rosy out here. Yeah. And for the longest time, people have known I'm, I'm single. It's actually a running joke everywhere. Yeah, yeah. Even for people <laughs> I, I, I don't know. Mm-hmm. So yeah. I, there was so this time nilikuwa nilikuwa Dubai mm-hmm. then I met a Kenyan who mm-hmm. follows me on Twitter mm-hmm. and um, the first thing he told me is at a Dubai unakuja <laughs> <laughs> what, what was his name we need to give him a shout out <laughs> <laughs> we could literally Ata, name the episode after that best <laughs> <name. laughs> at a Dubai so it's it's a running joke to yeah. strangers anyone I don't know or People were trying to know me. The first thing is a goofy, a yeah. single. Yeah. So Nairobi dating stories is stories and poetry about wow. our dating lives. Yeah. Mufasa okay. and and I. Yeah. So based yes. on true events, and based on some drama. True events. Wow. Mm-hmm. Because you. Know, oh, uh, really? uh, no uh, exaggeration. There's no exaggeration about the experiences oh. we've gone through. No yeah. mincing, no nothing. No mincing, no nothing. It's the way it happened. Oh shit. So you are coming to get real life. So if you've dated Goofy and Mufasa and you're in the audience. You <laughs> you know your that? content. <laughs> that's a, that's hey, wait hey, for hey, a turn. Hey. Hey. Wait for a turn. Okay. So I was I was going through the 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 ticket names mm-hmm. and uh yeah. All my exes have bought tickets. Oh, oh. dude, okay. I'm surprised you had you have exes. Yo, guys, um, who are that supporting? Because we, we, we yeah, fuck yeah. your show. <laughs> <laughs> heal, mama, heal. No, heal. Fuck don't you pull and a and your show. <laughs> don't pull a, a fifty cent on Jarul. <laughs> but he bought the whole entire front section. And all then, the tickets yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, So your exes have bought tickets. Yeah, but they're, are you they're, talking they're, terms? They're, they're just two, so okay, it's okay. it's not like they're many. Okay. And it's very boost street cred and it's for potentials. What are the names? No, no, no. man. We are such a small platform. Yeah. Only 1,000 people. So one, 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 <laughs> one, yeah. one is called Baby, the other one is called Babe. Babe. Yeah. Okay. Well, baby so Baby and Babe are about that. Are you guys yeah. in talking terms? Um, yes. Okay. We, 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 we ended things amicably. Okay. That's a big or rather, right Or rather, Niliacho amicably. Or right. Niliachana amicably. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's just that sometimes um, people talk about relationships mm-hmm. as this um, fairy tale where mm-hmm. it's just smooth oh. all through. Mm-hmm. But relationships, just like friendship or any other form of relationship, sure. it takes work. Yeah. Now, even like a small conflict can uh, inflate things, then the next day, yeah, okay. so it's just that I've been dating, it's just that I've not been public about it. Okay. I've been in relationships, but I've not been public about it. Okay. So you've been dating people, but on Twitter, you're single? Uh, people say I'm single. No, I've, you, I've never, I've, 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 I've never, I've never, I've never, I've never, I've never, I've never said that. You want to understand my I'm not just that. Luo men, Luo men will always look for a loophole. <laughs> or as I can call it, a loophole. <laughs> Actually, I've been dating people but not public about yeah. it. People what want to say, but I'm not denying. <laughs> no, no, like, for, for real, for real. Are you good with theirs? I have a dare for you. Uh, okay. This is Chaxi. Sure. This is, we're going down a yeah, I, I know. No, I, know I, I know Chaxi. <laughs> Say no. At least I know Chaxi. Say no. Yeah. No, let's make this interesting. Yeah. yeah let's so make this interesting. For you. Uh-huh. I want you mm-hmm. to add Babe and... Who was that one? B. And B mm-hmm. in a group now and just text see y'all on 24th. Oui. But they're coming. I'll see them. Ah, <laughs> just a That's group. A just a WhatsApp group. Add both of them and then say see y'all on 24th. Those those love love eye emojis. Yeah, okay, that's I'll, it. I'll I'll take the truth. <laughs> <laughs> and then also add me on that group so that when you leave, I tell you. <laughs> <laughs> Do they know each other personally? No, no, no. Okay. They 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 don't. 
They okay. don't. Yeah. Do they yeah. know? Do they know their stories are going to be on the show? Yes. Okay. Oh, you spoke to them. So they, they know. They know. It's it's a life experience. Guys. Okay. Yeah. So I'm I'm so free. It, also, it's your story. Yeah. Truly, I I, I, I I'm I'm free to to share. Okay. Yeah. What this guy want to conflict? They can put their own show. <laughs> <laughs> and sorry. <laughs> Party side B. <laughs> yeah. So it's, it's you, Mufasa. There are other people on the cast. Um, the the main um, it's Mufasa and I. Mm-hmm. Then we have um, uh, an amazing cast as well. Mm-hmm. We the whole premise of the show is we are sitting down to talk to therapists. Oh. So that's that's the whole story nice. behind Nairobi okay. dating stories. Ooh, okay. And for us, um, we have amazing. Uh, artists. Mm-hmm. Uh, we have Esther Kazungu. Shout hey, shout out to Esther. Shout out to Esther. Shout out, shout out. As you say the name. Okay, shout out to Esther Kazungu. Mm-hmm. And we have Mike Mushiri. Shout out to Mike. Yes. 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 Can we have him on so, the show? He's funny. Yes, of course. Yeah. So, but um, <clears throat> now that you guys are talking about dating, mm-hmm. when you cross over and get married, yeah. now when you do a show after marriage, mm-hmm. you can have us because you're marriage counselors. Mm. They were literally counseling her. They, can, <laughs> like, so they cancel. Like, they cancel marriage. marriage. got married last week. Yeah, so we we cancel married people. Yeah. So if you are, if you want to do something similar after you get married, <laughs> nah, yes. just yes, have um, come through this set. Yeah, oh, yes. we got you. And so, it's pro bono. So if <laughs> so, you your major is Kid Cora, your matrix. <laughs> <laughs> the cancel. <laughs> <laughs> took me a minute. I'll, yeah, I'll, yeah, I'll take one for the team. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But the Chaxi, that was a good I think Chaxi uh-huh. should be major because you have a Katamaji on your show. Yeah. Also, Chaxi has a tattoo of a cat, cat drinking, wine, drinking wine. And it's called Katamaji. It's called Katamaji. That's fine, isn't it? You don't think so? And add a one to your buzz. <laughs> <laughs> so it's let's five, just get more. Five, five point five. Ah, yeah. So I have another. What do you think he was two. at two? How is he five point five? Wait, 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 wait. Why you done drinking? Are you four point five? Because they should just be given zero. The buzz just, are not. Aye, bro. Just because, five, just because we wrote chocolate five one. times <laughs> doesn't mean it's wrong. You know those, those index ones when you're meant to at six percent maths, you have a hundred, mm. but you take the answer sheet to the teacher. This one you marked right, but it was wrong. You missed half that four. <laughs> yeah. So we we are we are we're sitting down with the therapist, yes. mm-hmm. and uh, if you know Mushiri and you know Kazungu, mm. they're very comical people. Yeah. Yes. They're comedians in their own in their own right. Yeah. So imagine talking to a comedian as a therapist. Yeah. So you can imagine um, what what is going to go through the show. Okay. So we have um, we, we, the, the show is in segments. Mm-hmm. We've said it's Nairobi dating stories. Yeah, because you have to change outfits. We know you. That's why you have segments. <laughs> hey. we'll it's not come, for the we'll show. Come, we'll come to that. <laughs> <laughs> we'll come to that. It's in segments. We're doing the poetry. It's really, really good. I think it's some of our, of our best work okay. um, we've ever written. Mm-hmm. Then the stories, that, that, now that's where we're, we're telling our stories and experiences mm. with our mamas. Ish. Oh, there's our mamas? Yeah, there's our mamas. Oh, like, wow. Yeah, okay. see my boy too, go okay. Even mm. or, even or, my mamas can, they can kill you literally. Yeah, true. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Number take twenty four hours a day for women. Yeah, add an extra hour <laughs> just, just to be sure. <laughs> yes. I, saw, I saw a meme of a bus. This buses that do uh, cross country, right? Mm-hmm. That had been parked by the roadside. I'm I'm assuming to maybe some some people wanted to pee a man in it. The normal thing stop mm. over. Then the caption reads: If the driver had to park and remind men to fear women. <laughs> <laughs> And just a Mombasara, somewhere yeah. in the middle of nowhere. Hey, even, even on my check, after every 40 minutes, we pause. <laughs> <laughs> to fear women. <laughs> can we have this pause now? Yes. Let's pause to fear women. Yeah, la, 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 la. <laughs> Shut up. Exactly why you should fear women. <laughs> the proof that's, is in the that same regard, I saw a meme today yeah. of, a, of a pastor mm. is kneeling. And then the caption is, I posed my someone mm-hmm. just to tell people to fear women. <laughs> Get out. We'll do. We'll do a dare with Chaxi. When you're going to the next place you're going to, we'll tell the cab driver to stop. Quite expressly, actually. Yeah, we just want to fear women. It's true, though. Let's do that on the express. Done. And here's, I think, I think women have the best PR out there. Because, um, they're, 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 let me just use the word atrocities mm. loosely. Mm. Mm. The atrocities are not publicized as much. Yeah. Mm. But our mama on is a character development <laughs> proper. <laughs> they can play you. They can uh, swing you around. Mm. They, Singing is fun, bro. 
Oops. Yes, oops. the Lord. Oops. Oops. Yes. I didn't mean See, sorry, but the other one. I meant <laughs> <laughs> not the one that inv- involves marriages. <laughs> <laughs> cannot yeah. address. I meant. But you you, you meant the one clip to sang. Yes, yeah, swing, oh, swing, yeah, yeah, zikini, yeah. bomba. Hey, and we're gonna get to that. Mm. So before, uh, 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 before we get into the poetry, because I'm personally curious to understand the journey from Nakuru to Nairobi. Yeah. Uh, you recently came from Ethiopia. Yes. I oh, call, Goofy called me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, yo, are you back? Because I. I was following his uh, journey in Ethiopia. Yeah. He's like, hey, you're Saki Kwangalea. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> was it really it that was, bad, like, though? Like, tweet and it was, yeah. Ethiopia. Oh, you're yes. talking about it. I didn't yeah. see the tweet. Yeah. I didn't tweet the experience. You said, like, he was like, what, well, Kenya? I appreciate yeah. so, it. It was like a heartfelt. Mm, was, just, yeah, was it Ethiopia. really that bad? Did you go just for fun? Were you there for something specific? Uh, what else happened? Did you get laid? All that. <laughs> I want to know everything in between. Let me ask a serious question before we get into that. Is Bole International that bad? The airport. No, the airport is is, is, is good. Raid. Okay. Yeah, it's good. It's just it's the, the the immigration bit. Oh, okay. That, so. That's where like everyone else is. That's a given, man. But okay. everything else is good. Okay. So yeah, wh- wh- is walk good. walk me through mm-hmm. the trip to Ethiopia. Yeah. So I travel a lot. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm a I'm a yeah, performing I'm a performing poet and a mm-hmm. filmmaker. Mm-hmm. And, and a content uh, creator. Filmmaker. Gotcha. Yeah. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> Political <laughs> correction. So, <laughs> hey, so um, yeah. travel is 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 the avenue or the medium that I use to oh. to showcase my my film skills. Yeah. Okay. And um, I have a I have a YouTube traveling vlog mm-hmm. or a blog or channel. Plug it. Yeah. Uh, it's called Going Goofy. Going wow. Yeah. Everything everything else is just going where I document my travel. Mm. So the Ethiopia trip was part of the bucket list that Plugged. I've had for oh. a couple of years. Mm-hmm. Mm. And then when a bunch of friends um, pulled up together, like the cost went down. Mm. It was like, ah, this is our opportunity yeah, to go. So oh, I yeah. I went. We were there for 17 days. Whoa. Um, Wait, were you with Kinarin? Yes, I was with Rin. Ah. Yes. Okay. Um, Ethiopia is a good country. It's a beautiful country, mm-hmm. aesthetically. Mm-hmm. But when you're on ground, it's... It's two conflicting uh, realities. Yeah, realities. To a foreigner or even to the people that live there? To them, it's, it's normal. It's, normal. Gotcha. It's, it's like they're used to it. Okay. Yeah. But um, things are very slow. Mm-hmm. The services are horrible. Mm-hmm. Um, we had a service provider lie to us. Mm-hmm. For example, they, they, um, the service provider who was taking... There's a place called Danakil, mm-hmm. depression. We did study that. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It's the hottest place uh, on earth. Um, it averages like around 60, 63 Damn. degrees mm-hmm. on a daily. That's what? what I was born. Uh, why are you not hot? <laughs> oh, buzz. They will give him. For real. Give Press him that bars. thing. <laughs> <laughs> you know why I said that's where I was born? <laughs> Look at me. Do you know I asked why you're Wait, not okay. hot? Wait, <laughs> 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 okay. <laughs> I saw a meme. Okay, then you get done a kill. I saw a meme. Yeah, no, a GIF. Not a GIF. What is this thing? Okay, whatever that thing is. It's like a GIF, but it's not a GIF. Mm. That oh, a sticker. Mm-hmm. Okay. A sticker that that treats you and your lady man You need to send. Yo, you've been kill. slacking. We need to make stickers now four weeks. Oh shit! I forgot I'm the sticker plug. I will send you. Take that off off the show. <laughs> <laughs> so um we we so this one service provider yeah. it it it's it's around uh it's around four hundred dollars from Addis Ababa to Danakil. Okay. Mm-hmm. The whole experience is supposed to take um four four days. That's mm-hmm. f- that's literally four nights. Mm-hmm. So we paid four hundred dollars for that per and per s- person. Per person. And the services were horrible because uh, a guy came and introduced himself as um, hi guys. First of all, they were late. Mm-hmm. They were supposed to come for us at 7. Mm-hmm. We woke up at around 5, get ready okay, and yeah, everything. everything yeah. They came at 8.20. They were like, oh, traffic, wow. all those things. Mm-hmm. Then the guy introduces himself as, guys, I'm your guide. Mm-hmm. So see, we know we have a guide. Mm-hmm. So we get into the bus. There are two other white people. Um, so we start our journey. Mm-hmm. So our first obstacle was when we got to a place called Samara. It's like a nine-hour... Uh, drive from Addis in a bus. Damn. In a bus, and it's but, getting hotter and hotter. No, 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 but it was a comfortable bus. Okay, okay. Yeah, and then we were just like um, eight people on the bus. Okay. Mm. Um, we get there. First of all, he gets water for the white guys. Ooh. We get we get no water. 
mm-hmm. notice it was like, ah, okay, maybe it's just, yeah. just you know. Maybe they paid for it. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like you should have asked him, what a guan? What a question. <laughs> so, uh-huh. um, so our troubles just started with the service provider. Okay. So we get to Samara, the guy is telling us, this is where you sleep. Mm-hmm. No, like, this is where you sleep. It's like, you guys, we're stopping here. Mm-hmm. We're spending the night here. So if you are on a service provider basis, you know, if you're stopping somewhere, mm-hmm. we've paid for this. Accommodation mm-hmm. So accommodation, sorted. food sorted, mm-hmm. everything. Mm-hmm. It's it's not part of the agreement. Whoa. So we had to pay for accommodation. So the $400 was just for the bus? The $400 was for the bus and now the Dana kill, which now I'm feeling like There's it, no it did not make sense. Really, yeah. yeah. So then we see... Yeah, yeah. Now we're 400. Yeah. So we get there, like uh, say around this time. Mm-hmm. We know we're leaving tomorrow. Tomorrow they're telling us there are clashes along the way. The clans are fighting. Mm-hmm. So we cannot travel. So we ask him, so are you sure um, it's going to be resolved? This nigger is so sure mm-hmm. that the conflict is just going to end in one day. So I was skeptical, but I said like, <laughs> okay. <laughs> so we, we, we waited for a day. We, mm-hmm. we lost a day. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And uh, the next day, we started our trip now to Dana So this Kiel. is the third day. Mm. This is the third day. Of okay. a four-day trip. Yes. yes. And you're not yet where you're supposed yes. to be. Yes. This is the third day. Mm-hmm. So um, we asked the locals, have they been fighting here? Nini, nini. I'm like, no, it's been safe. People have been coming. Mm. So that guy was lying. They lied to us. So we get there throughout the, the, the journey. No one is no one is asking if you're okay. Mm. It's just the, the white people. Um, then the, the, the lady, mm-hmm. um, apparently he, she's, she's French. Mm-hmm. She was very rude to me before we started the trip. Uh-oh. So when we got the first day, now we changed our itinerary. When we got to the place, mm-hmm. she came to me and said like, oh, Goofy, I'm sorry. I was rude to you. Mm-hmm. You know, it's the French people. And I was like, yo, you don't need to be rude to a stranger. Yeah. You and know, blame your country. Like, and then, yeah, blame, your and then, and then blame, your, blame your nationality. Yeah. Like, um, I, I know French people. French people are, are good people. Like, for example, Arsene Wenger. Oui. Like, we, 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 a, we, good, we. A, good, a good person, you know. <laughs> like, the, 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 the best manager football uh, has ever had. Let me ask you, how good. do you say yes in French? We. Oui. 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 Yeah. What happens when you add an N? Win. He doesn't know about winning. <laughs> 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 You are straight into that. <laughs> <laughs> I give you the car. We should start your story. Do not have walked into this. Do you know I'm shaking my head? <laughs> that's so bad. <laughs> uh, that's so bad. You can push a one plus three on a force. <laughs> uh, so, um... Mm-hmm. Those experiences, yeah. Yeah. if you add all of them up, uh, yeah. it, it does not make sense Truly. to me. Yeah. Because first yeah. of all, it feels like I've been shortchanged. Yes. Mm-hmm. We're not getting refunds. Yeah. So that meant that if we go back to Samara, we had to pay enough for accommodation as well oh. and food. So um, the whole package was supposed, after we've done with Danakil, mm-hmm. supposed to go to another place called Lalibela. Mm-hmm. So Lalibela is, is a series of churches in, each, in Ethiopia. Mm-hmm. Ethiopia is very famous for, for yeah. the Orthodox church. Yeah. They're like underground. They have their priests. It's very, it's very, it's very, it's very rich in texture, if mm-hmm. I may say that. Mm-hmm. So it's, if you're a photographer or a creative, oh, really it's a really place that you really enjoy. Okay. So we've lost one day in Samara. That means our Lalibel, our Lalibella trip has to be cut down by one day. Mm. So that means we go and rush. And personally, as a creative, I don't like rushing yeah. over, yeah. over over places or destinations. Mm. I just like to take my time. If I'd said I'm going to spend two days here, I know two days is enough for me to create yeah. and to experience the, the area. So we had to cut our Lalibella trip short. Whoa. Because no communication from the service provider. They're not even telling us if they're going to take us to Lalibela. Mm-hmm. So we cut our trip short. Yeah. We're going back to Addis. Mm-hmm. Um, they bring a land cruiser. Oh, now it's not a bus. Now it's not a bus. Okay. The land cruiser takes five people comfortably. Mm-hmm. And it's eight of them. Three at the back, mm-hmm. uh, one at the front, and now the driver. Mm-hmm. That's five. Yeah. So, um, so it's me, Rin, another babe called uh, S, mm-hmm. uh, my friend Scovia, mm-hmm. myself, and we met um, we met um, a German a traveler called Lily. So we are six of us. 
So two people had to sit at the front, Whoa, with the, the driver, driver, just like this, for nine freaking hours. And four people at the back. And f- uh, yes. Yeah. At, 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 no, 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 three people at the back. Okay. Oh, because you're five. Okay. Because you're five. Mm-hmm. Three people at the back. So they sat there for nine hours as we squeezed at the back. Mm. And uh, it's it's one of the most horrible experiences I've imagine. ever had. For nine hours. Yeah, for, for, for nine freaking hours. And uh, no refunds, no nothing. Mm-hmm. If I show you our, our text messages on WhatsApp, yeah. she was just like, uh, I know things in Kenya are different, you know, but this is Ethiopia, you know. Oh, There's nothing wow. much can do. So we, we're telling them how the white people are being treated. Mm-hmm. And then they're like, oh, uh, I know if, if that happens in Kenya, it does not happen here in Ethiopia. I was <laughs> like, yo... I, I just got tired. Yeah. And you know, when, when you put all these things together, yeah. my trip, first of all, has been cut short. Yeah. I've been dreaming of going to Lalibela. That's the one thing that took me to Ethiopia. Mm. I have no memories about that. Oh, no. oh, damn. So I have to plan again to yeah. go to Ethiopia. That's like... Yeah. It's not expensive. Yeah. Yeah. So, and uh, one thing I need to mention as well. Um, they, have, they have like currency, money crisis. Mm-hmm. So they either use dollars or beer. Mm-hmm. And their beer is stronger. So one Ethiopian beer is like three Kenyan shillings. Mm-hmm. So anything out there is just multiplied by three. Mm-hmm. And so we had two experiences where, uh, for example, they, they took us to an Orthodox church. Mm-hmm. And the tour guide was requesting 1,500 per person. 1,500 beer. Ooh, so that's 4,500. That's 4,500. Yeah, 4, per person. Yes. For a tour. Excuse me. Like he's taking you one one. I'm like all of you. Per person. It's not like a group thingy. Yeah. Per but person. But when he's taking you for the tour. Is yeah. 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 We, is, we are all together. So this okay. is the church. This is the church. So this for 45 includes the pastor touching you. Yes. So we 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 felt like for 500. <laughs> 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 Wait, what does he say? I think I'm too engrossed in this story. Uh-huh. He asked. Uh-huh. The for 500 includes the pastor touching you. <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> and you said yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, yes, it involves the pastor touching us. <laughs> Maybe it's on your head as you pray. Yeah. yeah. The, the, there was a sermon okay. during the. Oh, you guys threw a sermon? Yes, and the sermon really touched us, you know. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> this is one church or a bunch of churches? No, it's just one church. Okay. So it's like Unambu Peleko Museum, then Upemse Tautano. Well, for, 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 a, a, for a group thing? Yeah, a group thing. Per person. person. Makes no sense. So we, we told the guy, it's too expensive. Yeah. Yeah. Can we at least do um, something like a thousand bob per person? Yeah. yeah. Which now would make it to around 5Gs collectively. Yeah. yeah. And that's in exclusive of entry fees? That's a clus- uh, exclusive oh, of entry fees. Okay. Yeah. So they got angry. They were like, they don't understand how we can bargain. Negotiate. They were like, why are you bargaining? What do you mean, why? Why are you bargaining? <laughs> why don't you have money? You know, <laughs> first instance, yeah. the second is that we're going to book our buses to Lalibela. Uh-huh. Then a tour guide told us that um, there's another Orthodox church, mm-hmm. but um, he'll charge us around uh, $50 mm-hmm. per person to take us through the church. Mm-hmm. And it's something that we can do. So he told him, um, it's a bit too high. Mm-hmm. Yo. He was mad. The guy was mad. He started insulting us. Oh. Like, he caused a standstill at the bus because he was like, why are you guys over here? Why, why, in a way, it's like saying, like, why are you guys poor? Like, yeah. I'm telling you, I'm giving $50. It's a good deal. Why are you bargaining? Yeah. And then he goes like, I charge people $100 for Congratulations. this. Congratulations. It's like, yo, what's, what's with you guys and not talking or... Um, He's communicating. Yeah, just, yeah, just, yeah. just, just tell me in advance. Just communicate. Yeah, just, yeah. Yeah, just, and, uh, just say, I can't do that price. Sorry, my friend. Yeah. And we're backpacking. Yeah. That means I'm on a, a budget, very tight yeah. budget. Mm. And uh, maybe if I have money for inconveniences, it's not Is that, yeah, that I'm big. willing to break my you know, bank like that. Because I've, I've, I've saved for Ethiopia for almost a year. Mm. Because your traveling is is is, yeah, is, is an expensive thing. You know? And... So those experiences made Ethiopia very, horrible, yeah. very, oh, very horrible for me. For you, no, yes. but other than that, what was the? Let me ask the, the, hey, women, the women. Yo, hey, 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 what's the upside hey. of your trip? Okay, clearly one is the women. Give me no, 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 no. It's not. Clearly, that's the first upside. No, no, no. It's 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 not the women. I was I was actually I, I was I wasn't I wasn't impressed mm-hmm. really. 
You didn't get laid for 18 days in Ecuador. Uh, no, I represented Kenya really well. For real? Yeah. Ah. 21 seconds of honest work. Still longer than you, Moana. Still longer than you, Still longer than you, So any anytime a Kenyan breaks a world record, mm. we add a second. Huh? Any time a Kenyan breaks a record, or we add a second, we add a second. One, just one second. Just one okay. second. So now we're yeah. twenty. So if you last twenty seconds, you Faith Kipegon broke the fifteen hundred oh, yeah. meter record. Mm. So now it's twenty one. So now for the next one for me, it'll be twenty two seconds of honest work. Okay. So what's saying for nine? No, it's only much results. Hey, who said I'm Kenyan? <laughs> me was born in. I will know you. I grew up in Israel. <laughs> I'm not allowed to say this yeah. uh, on air, mm-hmm. but um, yeah, we'll, take, we'll edit the, the, out. I, I don't, I don't. <laughs> 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 we went to this small city in okay. in Ethiopia called Shushu, Harar. Right? Oh. Harar. Harar. Okay. It's um, it's it's a walled city. Uh-huh. Um, it's a very ancient city mm-hmm. where we fed hyenas, wild hyenas. Mm-hmm. So there's a culture going on there where they. There are two people who feed hyenas mm-hmm. every evening. So, <clears throat> sorry, we, we, we went Are they there. chained? No, they're not chained. They're wild they're animals. They're roaming freely. They're roaming freely. Shoo, shoo, yeah. shoo. Whoa. And, and they're, they're, they're like um, mm-hmm. 20, uh, 20 hyenas. Well, so that's Poji Chaksi. Uh, <laughs> many. <laughs> many. Many in seven <laughs> uh-huh. So what do you mean um, feed them? Like you give them food like this or like you throw? No, you give them. Off your hand? Yeah, off. off. There's a stick. Okay. Um, then the, the, the guy who feeds them like brings it close to your face. Then the hyena just takes it. Why is then your face there? Like, yeah? Why is your face there? Like it's it's part of the experience. So the hyena can choose your face. No, 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 no. It's just just the meat. Okay. Yeah. Can't be further from the face. Wait, it, it can be, mm-hmm. but, but, yeah, but it's, it's in close it's range. Yeah, okay. It's, yeah, okay. Yeah. It's, okay. It's yeah, I found that very uh, thrilling. Okay. Then the town gives me Lamu vibes. Mm. It's an old town, mm. very culture rich. Mm. Yeah. And um, it's it's a beautiful it's a beautiful city. So these hyenas yeah. are not like in a park, man. Like you could literally be walking down the street and you come across. Imagine you just bump yeah. into moas. That's wild. So guys <laughs> live with the hyenas. Yeah, guys, guys live. With it. It's like it's like uh, a cow. It's just like a cow. Yeah. So it's like <laughs> you, 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 you are the hyena and I'm the guy who's... And the guy. Yeah. Yeah. So the way we live, like, the, yeah, just in the same society yeah, the and whatnot, same it's a no from me. Yeah. Oh, or should I say it's a hyena? Really <laughs> 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 practice the episode. No, 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 that's... <laughs> That's a good yeah. joke, <laughs> but hyena the punch. You didn't want to go to Shashamani? Yeah. Um, Did you go to Shashamani? Truly. Nah. Nah. For real? No. Nah. You didn't want to? Want to? No. We, no interest. Our, our, our trips were very... Since we, we decided we were doing bus, mm. like in the country, mm. oh, okay. um, flights would be very expensive for us. Oh, you need to fly to Shashamani? Um... Wait. It's more convenient to, I guess. Yes. Ah, okay. 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 So uh, our, our, our destinations were far apart. Okay. Mm. So part and of those Ethiopia 17 days were yeah. just on the road, which I, I value. Yeah. I really love being on, Cause you see on the, the country. Because you see yeah. it. On the road, you see the country. Yes. As opposed to flying. Because flying, flying, you just arrive to a destination. That's yeah. it. Yeah. yeah. Eshi, eshi. So, the, okay. Back, <laughs> <laughs> back, back, back to the I women. speak a bit of... Uh, uh, Netoji. Amharic. Amharic, yeah. But, but you just know one word, Eshi. Eshi, Eshi, Eshi is like saying it's sour in Swahili. Yeah. Oh, that, then that's, that's it. Yeah. Okay, the women. Um, whatever my experiences were in Ethiopia, yeah. they're very, very controversial right now. Okay. If I say anything about, and I want to go back to Lalibela. Okay. Just yes. so maybe after I'm so going back to Lalibela, I, I wasn't, I wasn't as impressed. For real? I wasn't, oh, I wasn't, I wasn't. Okay. Oh yeah, because I'm like, yeah, everyone says <clears> they have really nice PR, like nine over nine. Okay. Yeah, I swear, I swear. Yeah. But the coffee yeah. is nice. Yeah, it's 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 very rich. It's Same like way. it's like uh-huh. it's like Indians with their babes. Uh-huh. Like you'll just admire them, but you can't get them because you know they they're just within the community. Uh-huh. And, 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 but and they're beautiful, that. like generally. Uh-huh. Like tens everywhere you go. Ten, ten, tens, ten, tens, ten, tens, ten, tens. ten, 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 ten. Nine point nine seven eight nine 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 nine. Are you normal? <laughs> there's, um, there's, 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 there's one beautiful um, Ethiopian babe I met, mm. and um, eh, yo, beauty. You were ready to risk it all. Mm. It's, it's just that it, it, if it wasn't for the experiences, yeah. 
Unajua the way BN sings oh na 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 lishwa na na kutishwa uso na kaliwa akia nani ningebaki huko kidogo utaka contact kidogo unyonyeshwe do you have a contact yo kwani do i look like mos yo I I I am hey. Mina Collins Sinjera hivi. <laughs> I I convert my G. I convert. I see you said it. I see you said it. I see it. I see it. Dana na sema Sinjera. Yeah, I got a bad minute, right? Yeah. Ah, that, that was, was a good a try. Good. Yeah. Oh, But damn. um where next for you on the tra- travel list? Um Namibia. Ooh. Bro, when are you going to Namibia? Namibia? I want to come to Namibia. Namibia. So let me plug my friend real quick. Okay. R- Robby. She's called Rioba. Mm. She plans uh, some of the best. Um, she's Korean like me. Mm. Ah. Yep. So right. Well, yeah, mm. she's a Bakura. Can I just say something? All, all really 14 bad. of them wanna join. Yeah. Was it on WhatsApp group ya Korea? Like I see her in the WhatsApp group. Mm. Yeah. Kuna wale wakucheka na wale wakuria. Kuna wakucheka na wakuria. Ah plug plug. Let me let me plug, plug uh, Rioba. Rioba organizes um, trips across the world. Okay. They're very well curated, mm-hmm. well balanced. Um, so we're going to Namibia with her. When is in, that? Uh, November. Okay. So it's a eight day trip. It's roughly around um, Uh, if i'm not wrong it's around 1200 dollars okay minus so your, only so your dollar it akwanga 250 yeah yeah minus minus the flight okay but, yeah so but um it's, can it's put a, in touch i really want to come to namibia mm. like a, yes, i've spoken yes. about namibia yeah, bunch of times yeah, yeah, we, really we could actually come. we could actually just form a whatsapp group uh, not mm. a, a message group yeah 20 mm. namibia is yeah. 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 done 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 remember yeah yeah we go cuz namibia is beautiful Um, Eight days in Namibia is crazy. Eight yeah, days, so we'll just yeah. record a bunch of episodes before we leave. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah. And then high itineraries are not like crushed. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's it's just like specific activities uh, for specific time, so you don't feel like you're just rushing through mm. um, travel. Mm. So, but, and that's how I like to experience it. Mm. Go to a place, take soak in, time. take my time, yeah. uh, write my poetry, take my photos, Ooh, nice. um, and have a good time. So, Rioba. Sometimes I edit when I'm okay. moving but for yeah. for the entire like now I have I have an Ethiopia uh, video man. that I need I need to <laughs> <laughs> Um TD if you're watching this I love you. Hey. Um TD, so okay. we <laughs> TD, I have the TD is a made up name. How do you how do you spell it? It's just like TD is amazing. It's just like TD. <laughs> <laughs> like one TD. Yeah, TD. like TD. Yeah, that, that was a... Okay, I thought it was yeah. like an acronym, TD. No, no, no. That's right. what you call it. Uh, so getting a, okay. one video for the whole... Yeah, for the whole experience. for the whole, nice. the whole trip. And um, sometimes I edit while I'm on the road. But most of the time, I just collect. Okay. So what I post mostly while I'm on the road is pictures with stories oh, okay. or things that I'm doing while um the I'm there yeah, while I'm on the move yeah isn't it interesting how like everything you do just comes together because I'm like brand partnerships isn't that like the most lucrative part of being like a filmmaker or content yeah. uh, creator isn't it? yeah because how else do you make money no there's other ways to make money yeah. but I'm like those endorsement deals is yeah, a big way you easy. make money so if you get to be on the road filming which you like and you're also able to plug in the clients you're working with like yeah. everything just yeah it falls it, together yeah. It, it, it falls together um beautifully mm. yeah but the i was in SA the creatives in SA on a cool vizuri but because mm. the collaborations are yo, actual collaborations yo yo um so, so I, I'm and a, the women are very like, beautiful oh, yeah, oh. now SA if you talk about women <laughs> SA <laughs> Yo, to the conversation, <laughs> no, no, we are getting countries as a whole. What yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. as I was saying, as you were saying. <laughs> hey, jump up! See you. It's, it's, it's beautiful down south. Yeah, it's such a beautiful down south. <laughs> um, yeah. the, 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 I interacted with creatives um, in SA. Um, so I was there for a personal trip. Then I had a brand partnership with Spotify. Spotify. Mm. So do we, uh, Spotify, we have beef with them. They didn't invite us. What's an issue? Show? Blah, 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 blah. Mm. Okay, guys, guys, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Me, if I go, I'll represent you guys. <laughs> so we're doing this whole Ama piano tour. Yeah. And um, why did you go for the Ama piano tour? Like, why? What was the criteria for selecting people to go? Um, I don't know the criteria. Okay. But uh, who else was there? Um. 
it was myself, mm. some two journalists from Kenya. Okay. You don't have to say their names. Um I'm asked to help. No, the 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 name in any in any in any portal is Cinda Matiko, mm-hmm. and uh, there's a TikToker called Cindy. So Ooh. from uh, mm-hmm. from Kenya. Zero zero three some. Yes 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 yes. Okay okay. Um, but for me, I started I started listening to Spotify the days when you're using VPN. Okay. Ah, okay. That was like years, years back. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And I've been, I think I've been tweeting about it. I've just been, I, I attached myself to the brand. Yeah. So okay. I think that that visibility was what like got it's their interest. Mm-hmm. Plus, I'm a dope creative. True, True for of course. Sure. So, I'll give you that. Uh, they, of course. They, yeah, they, they, I, we can't even that. No, of course. Yeah. Yeah. Magunga, you're lost. Actually, a friend, <laughs> a friend of mine who was a bit disappointed because they wanted you to cover something for them. Mm-hmm. Uh, when na, na, Nanyuki. Mm. But then you were unavailable. Yeah. You know who those are. Yeah. I, yeah. I, I, I know them. And it, from the brief, it was yeah. a dope, dope experience. Mm. But the thing is, if I cannot do work for you, mm. I recommend people who do Equally, yeah, yeah, don't go. Because you commanded Teti. Yeah, mm. Teti. And is shout out Teti. Teti is 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 a brilliant. It's like if if you have Teti, you have me. If you have me, you have Teti. So yes. like, like the, the quality, the, the quality yeah. does not does not drop. Yeah. So I, I they, they were sorted. They were. Sorted. Yeah. To look over with Teti, he was having the time of his life. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, <laughs> and I'm sure the content is fire. Yeah, I yeah, saw yeah, a, yeah, a bit gone. of it, uh-huh. and I'm excited to see what comes out of that. Yeah. So uh, I wasn't available for that, but yeah, yeah they 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 sorted. Yeah. So we were doing the Spotify tour. Okay. And uh, I'm a piano tour. Okay. And uh, guys, mm. the hype is real. Yeah. Believe the hype. Believe the hype. Mm-hmm. It, it, it's not music that just popped up mm. when now COVID hit. Mm. Mm. We're talking of decades in the making. Because mm-hmm. it started in the streets. Yeah. Uh, um, sorry. That's TD. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> so like it's 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 years and years. It's yeah. like if we cultivated kapuka yeah for this long, eventually it would have but, like yeah. boiled and gone out there. Mm. So for them it started in the streets and uh, their streets are like Soweto, mm. Mamilodi, mm, the townships, where, yeah, the townships yeah. where where the people are. Mm. And um I found that interesting as part of their culture yeah. and where we think that creatives or a certain aspect of um, art does not just pop overnight. Mm. It, it takes years. It takes mm. time of cultivating, yeah. trying out some things. Before that, there was Kwaito. Kwaito didn't make it out of the hood. Mm. And people build from Kwaito. Then they got into now I'm a piano. Yeah. Okay. And Actually, then they now, got into, I think, Deep House Deep first. House yes. first. Yeah. Then I'm a piano. Mm-hmm. And now everything is excelling. Deep House, yeah. like yes. in a black coffee, everyone. They everyone traveling is all getting their piece yeah. of I'm the I'm a piano, everyone is traveling, yeah. True. So it's, yeah. it's... It's progressive. It's, it's been, it's, it's yeah. been work, constant work. Yeah. It's constant work. People might not see it. Mm. And, and I think that's, that's the beauty of art. Mm. When, when, when it blows, it blows. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. The question now is, will it find you ready? Mm. Or you're just there for... For two, three years, then it got it's tough, yeah. Yeah. and um, and and you left. So mm-hmm. it's that's that was the beauty of it. So through that uh, journey, you 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 meet with creatives, mm-hmm. and they're telling you how the brands in SA work. They approach them. Mm-hmm. I'm a Sony shooter. I love Sony, mm-hmm. um, but in Kenya, there's no there's no official Sony shop. Mm-hmm. Um, they don't send things to Kenya, so like we don't have. You don't have a direct shoot. link to yeah. Sony. Just buy from whoever decides to buy it. Mm. Yeah. And I got there. Some of them know me. Mm-hmm. And they were wow. like, yo, we love your work. Mm-hmm. That's crazy. Mm. You, and and it, it, it caught me by surprise because like, it does not translate here in Kenya. Yeah. Like, yes, we're getting deals, but it's not as good. It's, it's not as good. It's not as, 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 as lucrative mm. as, as SA. But then again, it just takes time. Mm-hmm. Because I feel like the, the the Kenyan creative scene, the aspect of it where now it's social, um, started coming up around 2020 mm-hmm. when COVID hit. Now that's when now like some few more doors were opened. Yeah. But in said they figured it out. They 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 the, the brands pay well. The partnerships are dope. Mm-hmm. Um, I have a friend of mine who was given a Ford and um, he took it to Namibia. Whoa. And he shot crazy Continent, stuff, yeah. you know. Yeah. Um, he was giving a talk about DJI drones. This is like partnerships 
Kenyans dream of. Yeah. And I'm just not talking about myself. I'm talking about all the general yeah. good creatives yeah. Yeah. Uh, in Kenya who are doing dope stuff, even the Nai. Say, for example, Mutua Mateka. Mm. Mutua Mateka is an OG. Did you see It's uh, the Rich? Yes. Um, we have TJ. Mm. They're doing amazing, uh, amazing Mike, stuff. Mike check. Uh, <laughs> I'll come to that. <laughs> Mike check. Saving the best for last. <laughs> <laughs> They're doing amazing yeah. stuff. Mm. But um, if, if, so if you compare the two, the two markets, mm. so my word just out there is, mm. if you see a brilliant creative, um, brands mostly, mm. hop, onto, hop onto their wagon. Mm. They have little communities tell, of people. Tell that to Spotify. <laughs> <laughs> tell, tell them to invite us. You're the direct <laughs> link. <laughs> We're sending you. So, uh, Spotify. Hi, <laughs> But, but but Spotify are really big on podcasts right now. Yeah, yeah. Tell yeah them. they they, they, they tell them. no 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 relax. This is Spotify. Tell them. Trust me, yeah. the what the every opportunity I get, yeah. I mention my people. Uh, yeah. Of course, everywhere I go, Lovely. and I think that's that's how I've also like gotten work and traction. Uh. People mention me. Mm. And sometimes even if I don't get the job, mm -hmm. you know, just having that conversation. Mm. That's it. That's it's it's dope. Because yeah. right now I'm seeing the, the rates and the quotes I'm doing. They're not, they're, they're, they're huge. You're goofy. They're, they're, <laughs> they're, they're, they're not the same uh, like quotations goofy. I used to do like yeah. two years ago. Mm. So even if I, if you ask me, say a big brand like mm. Sony, as like, yo, I want to give you a product, send us a quote. That's a win for me. Yeah. Because mm. now I'm 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 in conversations around spaces that yes. now can give me opportunities. Yeah. And um that's how things have been happening to me. Mm -hmm. So the thing is we just need to like stay grounded enough. Mm -hmm. We are not supposed because art generally is a is a tough thing. Mm. And we are we're, we're coming from a country where it's not as celebrated. I come from a family where my brother and my sisters are doctors. Mm -hmm. My two mothers wanted me to do medicine. Mm -hmm. I did not do medicine. I, two mothers? Yes, I have two moms. Okay. Yes, my dad married two wives. Mm. That's an OG. Yeah. And their sisters. Mm -hmm. Their wives are sisters? Yes. Yeah. So, 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 you are... Uh, <laughs> your auntie is your mom. Mom. Yeah, my auntie is my mom, but yeah. uh, we don't say it that way. They're, they're all our yeah. mothers. No, so but, it's, it's, but is your auntie is your mom. It's weird for me to... Are you being serious? I'm, yeah. I'm being very serious. He mentions it a lot. Yeah. Oh, damn. Even uh, the they're, they're, yeah. they're, they're our mothers. Like, so who, uh, who did your dad like, like first? Um, my, my mom. Your mom? My big mom. Then, so, the sister was like, I want that too. Um, <laughs> uh, it, 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 do you want to get into the yes. short story <laughs> of it? Time. Okay, but Have before time. before that, I, I was <laughs> shouting out... Fuck creative. <laughs> 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 Creatives can speak for themselves. Every time I see yeah. if you see Chad, I don't know when this is. I just is about to get very out of pocket. No, no, the way. But you see, Mimi, uh, I genuinely yeah. thought you're just messing. No, 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 no. I was raised by. Will you tell us that story? Yeah. You're succeeding in Nairobi because of your prayer, two moms praying for you. Yeah. I've seen yeah. that tweet, yeah. but. Mm -hmm. I didn't know, like, when I just said, I was like, it's just playing around with words. I don't no, know. no, 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 no. It's, it's, uh, I, I, I come from a very large polygamous family. But before What's we get there, oh, oh. let me, let me finish, oh, oh. let me, let me, let me finish with, with okay. this, with this bit. Okay. Um, so if, if we plug it to poetry, mm -hmm. let me give you a quick history of, of poetry in Kenya. Mm -hmm. Um, we have very few people who've stuck with poetry. Mm -hmm. Poetry is not as big as music. It's not as popular as music. Yeah. Mm. But a bunch of creatives around uh, 2010, 2011 came together and we started this uh, event. Mm -hmm. And we've, 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 we've probably held the, the biggest Slam Africa competition mm. on the continent mm. consistently. And there's, there's, a, there's a time we did a festival mm -hmm. and over the three-day festival, we had around 3,000 people come yeah. in. Just to listen to poetry, buy our merchandise, talk about called? it. Do you remember it? Slam Africa. Slam Africa, yeah. yeah it's called Slam Africa. And mm -hmm. many other small, small events that mm -hmm. now give uh, space for creatives to come, mm -hmm. where we do workshops. Mm -hmm. um, we, 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 we tell people how to do their craft. Mm -hmm. So, you know, for us, we learned the hard way. Everything I know now is, is, is learning on the job. Mm -hmm. It's self-taught. What I see here, this works. Mm -hmm. This didn't work. This is going to work well. Mm -hmm. And um, we've, we've done offices, works, we've, we've done proposals, we've met with CEOs. 
And the common thing that we've been getting over the years is we don't have the numbers. Mm. Mm. And I, I think that's that's a cruel way of looking at it because yeah. sometimes these things don't need numbers. It yeah. just needs a community. Yeah. Exactly. Because if you have a community of around a thousand people and they're loyal, that's they're loyal, you, you, you can tap into that. Yeah. That's that's what that's what you actually need. Yeah. You have access to those other yes. people. Yes. So it's it's um I've been self-funded for the longest time ever since I started doing poetry. Yeah. I work my ass off. Mm -hmm. I channel it back to the poetry. The events that I do, it takes money. Mm. Artists that I feature, I need to pay them. Yeah. Venues are very damn expensive yeah. in in uh, in Nairobi. Most of them are booked for the whole year. So if you don't get a venue that you can afford, mm -hmm. you either Good. go back to the grind, get a job, mm. top up the difference so that you do your event. Yeah. So that's that's the hard way we've learned uh, through poetry. But I've been doing poetry professionally since 2015. Oh, eight years. Professionally. Professionally. But I started performing when I was still in kindergarten. Wow. So yeah, I, I, kindergarten I, uh, yeah, yeah, I was in kindergarten. Yes, yes, yes. yes. <laughs> <laughs> so um, my, my point is, if brands are watching this, yeah. if people who have money are watching it's, this. If Spotify is watching this. Yeah. <laughs> 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 plug into these communities. Okay. And uh, it doesn't necessarily just have to be poetry. Mm. There are graffiti artists out there. There are dancers. Mm. There are makeup artists. F join, plug, and sometimes you don't even need like 20 million. Mm. Uh, uh, it's, 14 it's, is enough. Yeah. If you, if, if, you come, <laughs> if you come to a creative and tell them, we, we, we are paying for your venue for a whole year. Mm -hmm. That's a lot. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's a lot. You know, that's the thing we, we yeah. say a lot on this podcast mm -hmm. is that a lot of the guys who are creating, people don't even necessarily need money all the time. People yeah. need mm -hmm. access to the resources. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Produce whatever produce. they want. Mm -hmm. If it's venues, if it's equipment. Like, mm -hmm. guys just need access to yeah. whatever things, they need yeah. to create. People yeah. don't even need mm -hmm. money per se. Yeah. Of course, you need money. Yeah. But if guys, are, if you had access to good studios, good mm -hmm. venues, good... Um, uh, good equipment. Because equipment. Yeah. we can work within ourselves. Yeah. You know, if I if we need someone, uh, a good videographer, we know you Goofy, know you know call. what I mean? Yeah. If mm. you need guys who can just talk shit for a whole day, you know you can call Mike Check. Mm. You know what I mean? yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, it's, it's, yeah. it's been a journey. Uh -huh. And uh, for me, this will be my 12th concept event. Wow. wow. Where I write a show, it's a poetry show, mm -hmm. it's a two-hour show. And it's well scripted. The concept is solid. It's like a whole production. I've seen yeah. it. It's it's um it's it's lighting. Mm -hmm. I we have a stylist. Oh, we have stylist a, and a brand bar. Brand bar. Oh, under the chikonga budget uh, water. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Every six <laughs> minutes. Last month we got your budget your brand bar. You know, there's another show. We have a producer, a production manager. Like have a host. The, there's you know, have a host, we have nice. promo. Nice. It's 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 a whole process. Mm. I don't just wake up and say, like, ah, I'm doing a show. Mm. Then we have rehearsals, mm. which people now get very surprised. Like, Goofy, you do rehearsals. We need rehearsals. We're like, yeah. yeah. So guys I expect you just show up, show up, and, and, and just and, pull a mic check. And and, and, yeah. right. <laughs> and the most unique yeah. thing about say what Mufasa and I do, mm -hmm. and uh, other notable mentions, like say. Dauphin mm -hmm. of the recent Slam Africa champion called Slim Shaka mm -hmm. is when you come to our show, it's new pieces all the time. Mm -hmm. The next show is new pieces. It's a new concept. Mm -hmm. It's a new production. Yeah. So there's that element of creativity that is is always going on and on and on and on. Mm -hmm. So over those 12 uh, events, it's self, self-funded. Mm -hmm. yeah. And I think last year, over the past two years now, that's when like it started like giving mm -hmm. back. Yeah. Where now you're you're selling out shows more consistently. Mm. People are buying your merchandise. People recognize you now as a poet. Mm. Um, there's more respect. Brands now want to come and work with you, but still they need that like the, extra. Yeah. No one is going in two feet. Yeah, no one is going okay. in uh, in two feet. And it's it's unfortunate because I think like they're missing out. Mm. If if they plugged already when we're doing Slam Africa, mm. Slam Africa now is 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 not entirely on its feet because we. At some point, we got broke yeah. mm. trying to fund these dreams. And also, life happened. Just yes. People went, mm. people, people went to yeah. their, their separate mm. ways. Ethiopia. <laughs> 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 um, but it's, yeah, it's, it's, been, it's been a beautiful journey yeah. as a poet in Kenya. Yeah. Yeah. I've done a lot. We've done a lot, Shinyamaji. Yeah. And the thing is, it, it's a vibrant scene. Yeah. 
it's 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 a you vibrant have any backing your show coming up in June. You can mention them if they're um, back. Yeah, we recently got into a partnership with um, uh, Beef Eater. Nice. Shout out, so, shout out uh, to Bifita. I, I also, I also work personal because I know you work with them. Yeah, I, but, I create. But I now create for they them. are part, they are they're helping with the, the gig. Show. Yeah, they're helping with the gig. Shout out. Yeah, we've we've, nice. we've we've partnered with them for the gig for mm. the two days. Okay. You, the next gin you're buying us, baby Fita. Yeah. Support yeah. them. So today. <laughs> So today, <laughs> <laughs> the next hour. Yeah. No, for real. Because cause me, I'm big on if there's brands that genuinely spend money yeah. on some of the guys we really fuck with, we just fuck yeah. with them as well. Because yeah. 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 either way, we sustain the brand, the brand sustain the people we care about. Yeah. Yeah. True. So we, we, I hope now it opens more doors mm. and more conversations around yeah. making it sustainable. Mm. It's it's not it's not a one off kind mm. of kind of thing. Yeah, conversation. Um, more more long term. Because okay. I, I I keep telling my friends, if I had the opportunity, mm-hmm. I, I'd just be creating for free. Mm. Where I, I, I go somewhere, take photos, do exhibitions for free. Yeah. Uh, take videos, post them for free. Write Beans poetry was not an issue. Yeah. for free. But you see now, if, if I do 17 days in Ethiopia, Someone needs to I have to come back yeah. and work my ass off for, say, the next three, four months before my next trip. Mm. So that it, it, keeps on, it keeps on going and going and going. So... I am very hopeful that the partnership that we're having right now will be long term. Will be long term and more beneficial because it's not just about me. The way the way I see poetry in Kenya is, uh, I want it to be a system where workshops are consistent, yeah. avenues are consistent, and with that, the growth is not just linear. Yeah, it's very, it's very so it, all it round. Yeah. It it True. it it spreads. Because if you find me, trust me, I'm not just going to do poetry events. Yeah. Mm. I'm going to Nakuru, I'll do a workshop. Mm. I'll fly to Mombasa, I'll do a poetry show, I'll do a workshop. Wow. Pay you know? Brian Babu. Yeah. Mm. Like I'll, half I'll, the yes. I'll pay <laughs> Brian Babu half the budget. Yeah. <laughs> um, I'll, I'll use fuel to come to mic check yeah. and talk about these experiences. Yeah. Mm. I'll, the I'll, money spreads. Yeah, yeah. The, it, yeah. It, okay. it, it, it goes beyond now just goofy. Yeah. And, and that, that has always been, cool. been, been my dream. I've tried it before. We've we've done workshops, and and probably one of the biggest achievements of my poetry career is I was part of the team that helped the Ministry of Education mm-hmm. to introduce spoken word as a category at oh. the Kenya National Drama Festival. Wow! So we worked for that. that. Never existed. Yeah. It no. never existed. Oh. So the, the choral verse, the nini, they're all being treated differently. They're, they're all separate. Verse. So okay. now there's spoken word category. Okay. Wow! And what that means to other creatives is. Now schools approach you to write for them. Uh, schools approach you to go and uh, teach, the teach their kids. Nice. And okay. I, I can't be in all schools. Yeah. You know. So there are people who, who are doing that, people who are earning from that. Okay. Mm. And it, it's probably one of my proudest moments. Wow. Congratulations. Yeah. That's, that is, yeah. that's really cool. That's really cool. Yeah. That's really cool. So um, if, if we get more of these wins, then it means poetry just stops being about a niche thing mm. where... If you're going to a poetry show, it's like 200 people. Yeah. Yeah. I know that we're here. You've talked about concept shows, mm-hmm. the ones you've done. Uh, Black Boy Joy was one of them. Yes. Uh, the Other Things and Love. Yeah. Mm. And then now there is Nairobi Dating Stories. Yes. Mm. Maybe just paint a picture and break it down to what a concept poetry show is mm-hmm. um, and how it's different from just coming to see poets perform pieces on stage. Okay. Yeah. So um, so there, there, there are like two major types of performances. Mm-hmm. There are open mics where anyone is free to talk about anything and everything, mm-hmm. where anyone can just come and do their piece. There's no theme, there's no um, like a direction they're following. You can following. just use those to practice your yes, 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 yes. showcase your work. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And it's open to everyone. Okay. Now for us, um, which I think is, is another category that we introduced, mm-hmm. um, the likes of Mufasa, myself, Ngatia, Dolphin, mm-hmm. we're the people who popularize concept shows, concept poetry shows in Kenya mm-hmm. where you just don't come and stand with the mic do your piece mm-hmm. and go there's music elements to it mm-hmm. there's there's art like there's a whole <laughs> dimension yeah. Yeah. such that before I go on stage mm-hmm. um, a it's mood is set. yes a mood is set and you have you, you, you had original programming even for your yes. the music was yes. like, uh, yeah. like composed just for the show for the wow. show it's it's original original stuff yeah mm-hmm. so where uh, you stick with the cinema mm-hmm. with the, with the <laughs> 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 you stick with the story yeah. and you run with it uh, Bakamusho. Yeah. but like the other things in love was uh, 
a couple in a relationship. Mm. So they're, they're fights. Mm. So one started on the happy note of it. Mm. I started on the sad part of it. Then, they all then we came them. together. Then we switched. Mm. I went to the happy... Sad. Sad. The sad. sad. She went to the, happy. to the happy. But in the middle is where now we showcased... You actually went to the happy? No, no, Chucks, no. no. You, you get the you boy in... from the sad. I started from the sad. So you went to the happy. I went to the happy. Okay, so yes. So the middle, we, 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 we get now... <laughs> all the juices. Right yeah, there. all the juices. Mm. Then we, we, we cross again. Mm. And it was so beautifully done. The music, mm. composed, original, all those things. So the lighting. Yes. Mm. So it's, it's very... Let me just say, it's, it's, it's more of, mm. of, of Broadway... Broadway mm. texture! Mm. Yeah. 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 Love it. So, 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 yeah, so um, in a company, it's a normal. Yeah. For sure. Yeah. Yeah. Nairobi dating yeah. series, yeah. This, these are two slum African champions. Oh, wow. okay. I'm a 43rd slum Africa <laughs> champion. Mm. Uh, Mufasa is the 40th mm. slum Africa champion. Yeah. Wow. So this, this is royalty on stage. This is royalty mm. on stage. The, 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 the refined stuff. Nice. This is based on true events. Mm. <laughs> the following events so, took place so, in Nairobi. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so how, yeah. so how, how, what do we do to switch our tickets to Sunday? What do we need to do? Um... I'll talk. I'll talk. I'll, I'll talk to the production manager. Okay, if it's possible, if it's not possible. Don't worry. Yeah, no, I'll talk. I'll talk to the production manager. Yeah. Um. The Sunday show is around thirty percent sold. Okay. okay. So, um, if you guys can promise that you fill the seat on Saturday. Yeah. Okay. So that we don't have empty seats. Okay. Then I can switch your tickets to Sunday. So that one is easy. We'll figure yeah. it out. Okay. Because Saturday, Saturday show uh, is sold out. It. Yeah, Saturday is sold out. So if we switch yeah. us the seats, then it means we have empty seats. Two empty yeah. seats. Yeah. You know what Saturday, we'll do? Saturday. Saturday. Yeah. Both of us will just tweet. We have two tickets on sale for the Saturday show. Whoever sells them, we buy the Sunday ones. Yeah. Yeah, or... You could just buy the just, Sunday show. Or yeah. I could, just, I, I could yeah. get the Sunday show... And give out the Saturday the tickets. to someone. Yeah. So if you yeah, if you listen to this now, you know, <laughs> on Saturday, yes. yeah. hit me up. I'll hook you up with the for Saturday. Because now there's a lot well. for Sunday. That's two yeah. tickets. Done. Sorted. Mm. So, uh, cool. Then see yeah. you guys on, on 25th. Okay. Uh, 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 yeah. And see on 24th, on 24th towards, towards the end of Fox Fusion. <laughs> 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 As we are walking out, we'll say bye. But, uh, and uh, just, yeah. just to mention, mm. um, I grew up, or rather, my journey has been surrounded by creatives who are blowing up right now. Yeah. Uh, like Ash, Ash. Tell Spotify. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait. Okay, it's giving begging for real. <laughs> it's giving no. begging. <laughs> uh-huh. Spotify. <laughs> Daniel Fights. Uh-huh. Um, yeah. Ben Sol, Eros, Motoria. Motoria. Oh. Um, those are people we, we, we were with in the poetry circle. They're mm. people who've also contributed so much to the culture. Because yeah. mm. I remember there's the... Um, uh, Mutoria actually is my producer. Mm-hmm. He's been producing my poetry He's literally albums. just been calling me now. Yeah. I was like, almost speak, but... Yeah, so um, mm-hmm. these are people who've contributed to the about. poetry culture. Because yeah. we've collaborated with them um, some few years back. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And it's, it's just amazing to see that now they... They're, they're, they're going very, very, very wide and mm. their creative juices are still running on, mm. on an international platform, yeah. which, which is good. But they've been here like for years and years and years and years. Yeah. Grinding. Yeah. Consistently so, grinding. Uh, a big shout out also to Erosh. Mm. Erosh, um, I'm sure if I call him right now and say like, yo, I have a show on the 24th. I'm pretty sure Erosh at our channel and a folk fusion. <laughs> <laughs> Like, I think I'll show you 25th. Yeah, yeah. Kama has a buy ticket, he's planning to buy He's got tickets. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's like, you know, Goofy, 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 Goofy is my guy. Mm-hmm. Push uh, the gig. Yeah. Yeah. Like, you know, <laughs> I'm about to go on. Okay. <laughs> <Knock out. laughs> Goofy's about to go yeah. on, guys. Sorry, thank you. <laughs> you, you. You mentioned something mm-hmm. that I think yeah. is very essential and ties back to us having the conversation earlier mm-hmm. on that an industry doesn't happen overnight. It's mm-hmm. progression. Things yeah. happen over time and everyone... Everyone, everyone does what they need to do. It comes together. Mm-hmm. Now, talking about concept shows, there's uh, like the shows you guys are doing and then there's open mics. Yeah. Now, I see a lot of similarities between comedy and poetry mm-hmm. in that open mics are very necessary platforms. Because I'm thinking about a young comic or a young poet who's coming up. Maybe they're writing, but they need 
an outlet to perform. Mm. Yeah. We have social media now. You can post it on Instagram, whatever, and yeah, reach whatever people you need, right? Mm -hmm. But then I think there's something beautiful in having spaces where you can go try out this material, yeah. but also meet other similar people. Mm -hmm. And I've seen like the comics are doing a lot of that. You know, shout out to guys from Punchline. Mm. They're creating like every day I'll see there's a new venue that has comedy. Mm. So they're creating a lot of spaces where they can go try out material, but also mingle and meet other comics mm. and the community is growing, but I don't see a lot of that with poets. Um, like open mic spaces. Um, open open mic spaces died um, when COVID struck. Um, in Nairobi, Nakuru, and Eldoret, in any given weekend, you couldn't miss at least three different poetry shows. Okay. Like in, in Nairobi... That we would use, be open mic or that would have just a, a specific lineup? Open mics and then specific lineups. That's you. Um, we, we'd start our events on Friday. Mm. If there's a, there's a poetry, there's a poetry event called Poetry Spot. Mm. It used to happen at All Saints Cathedral. Mm -hmm. Then there was another poetry event called Eve of Poetry. That was happening at St Andrews. Mm. So we'd we'd start with Poetry Spot from uh, six to eight. Mm. Then we'd go catch the last hour and a half of Eve of Poetry. Mm. Then Saturday there are like two events. Mm. Then Sunday there's like one person doing uh, another, another event. event. So it was it was all round. Mm -hmm. But then what? What COVID did was it slowed down. Oh, you slowed down then. Picking up nicely. Yeah, we, 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 yeah. we, 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 we'd actually picked in terms of doing consistent events. Those Fat, Fatima's something was that yeah, a Fatuma's voice. It was, was, yeah. was a poetry, poetry thing. as well. Poetry Fatima's and conversation. Because yeah, yeah. I've been to one. Kwani. Kwani. Yeah. Was it was a, then there was Kwani. Kwani. Yeah. yeah, open mic. Yeah. Um, then the, there's also poets you should know, which used to happen at the museum. Mm -hmm. You see that Kateras where Mugambi did his yeah. Oh, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, shout yeah. out. It's his uh, shout out. Brilliant yeah. thing. Yes. We used to feel that every Sunday. Oh, wow. oh damn. Yeah. Everyone like the like everyone sat mm -hmm. and then people stand mm -hmm. just to come and listen to to open mic. So when COVID happened, uh venues started becoming Shut a bit down. tricky because now that means you have to like um, start new conversations yeah. and kiss us again to get uh, the venues. Yeah, so it's slowed down, but it's it's coming back. Mm -hmm. It's coming slowly. back. It's coming back slowly. Mm -hmm. And the thing is, mm -hmm. the the comedy community borrowed a lot from the poetry community. Mm -hmm. Yeah, in terms of structures and doing things. Because mm -hmm. yeah. for us poets, we, we don't care really. Yeah. We are doing our thing. We are going to push it. Yeah. I have an event. I, I really don't care how work it is. Mm. I'm, I'm going to sing about it. I'm going to tweet about it. Yeah. Yeah. So it, it grew from having 20 people, then 15 people artists, mm -hmm. to selling 80 tickets, to doing 200, mm -hmm. to doing 350. Now we're doing 400. Mm. And then like, it's now like if we get bigger venues, we definitely can't fill those um, yeah. uh, bigger venues. Yeah. So it's, it's there and it's, it's, it's still coming back. Mm. Yeah. Interesting. Um, I've not forgotten the story. Oh yeah. Yeah. Um, I I I I am Luo, mm -hmm. but my friends call me Luo Mui too hey. because. What what are you doing? Let me guess. You can't speak Luo. No, I can speak Luo. Okay. Oh, you can. But yes. um, uh, my 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 dad took us to a very uh, group of school schools, mm -hmm. and um, we were just learning English. We we're doing some bit of French, mm -hmm. and uh, we. <laughs> so um I grew up in Nakuru. I was born in Nakuru, raised in Nakuru. Mm. And um I found myself having two moms, just mm. born in a family. But the, the, the long story of it is my my dad married my big mom. Mm. And then um she's 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 asthmatic. So there's a time my, my big mom was hospitalized for almost a year and a half. Yeah. So all the resources just went there to the hospital, making sure she's okay. So when she thought she couldn't make it, because now no one was there, her reasoning was no one was there for my dad and her kids. Mm. She suggested to my dad that instead of looking for someone else out there, mm. just get my, sister. get my sister. And... Um, he got the sister. Damn. Then my mom made a recovery. Ooh. Like, she got better. Yeah. And um, up till today, we don't know what happened. She just, like, recovered from being in the hospital for over a year and a half. Mm -hmm. In and out, in and out, hospitalized. So what, what do you do with that? You just continue with the, As is. Yeah. Would they, the family. Would you guys live, like, in the same house? Yeah, we were raised in the same house, one big house. Yeah. Um, 
Um, I, I, I used to, you know, when I was young, I couldn't understand these things. Yeah. But when, when oh, everyone else was going to sleep, my dad was sharing a bed with these two mamas. Eh, who Wait, sisters? you know, one one bed. Yeah, one bed. Three like, sums every night. Yo, dude. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I told you he was gonna get out of pocket. <laughs> so how is that out of pocket? It. Because I can't ask questions. When are you the one answering? <laughs> I thank you, God. I'm not Wait, the one. So answering. one, one bed, room, one bed. Head. Yeah, one then bed, one bed. Your dad. I, I guess the point I'm saying is it was a very, <laughs> <laughs> it was a very uh, close yeah. close family. That's true. Okay. And uh, when when my mom was doing long long um, travels business, my mom was there. Like your mom, mom now. Yeah, my mom, mom. Okay. Mm. Then when my mom was doing all those business, my mom was there. So it's ah. it's like we've been raised by everyone at, at some at certain point. point. Oh, that's why it's two moms for you. That's why it's okay. two moms. Okay. It's uh, wow. it's 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 two moms for for me. This is very and, interesting. Uh, I've never right? had this setup before. Yeah. And they're, like... they're very they're very they're very close. Yeah, the sisters. Yeah, the sisters. I so when that, when yeah. when my dad uh, when my dad passed, oh, sorry, man. you know you know when they're like family, Chiefs, yeah, Chiefs, and all yeah. that, they 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 they're still together. Oh, nice. like they're running the businesses together. Yeah. Wow. Uh, property is uh, under their names. That's they're very beautiful. tough on uh, uncles who are not necessarily uncles uh, for they the family. Too. Yeah. yeah, and um, the the let me tell you the funniest story well, that my mom told me. <laughs> Uh, actually, my mom is calling me. Can you ask? Uh, <laughs> it's a blessing. Do you want to be on the show? Do you want to be on the show? Mama, mama, hey, 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 hey. hey. Is he gonna pick? Go down, yeah. go down. <laughs> Hello, mama, Niaje. Yeah. Uh, una una niskia? Eh, na pia. Sasa niko niko kwa show flani na record. Eh. <laughs> Uh, salimia, salimia watu wapa wa Hi, Hi, mom. Hi, mom. <laughs> 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 Maybe we'll say we'll plan and then I'll like, oh, okay, let's, 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 yeah. let's just, 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 let's how are you? I'm fine. Una do you have any kids now? Come simu. Ah ah. I'm excited to come and me. Eh, see ni mami ake. Nice hearing from you. Thank you. Oh, welcome. Ah, uh, nita nita kupigia niki niki fika kwa nyumba. Ah ya. Ah ya, Sante. Karibu. Hi. Uh. <laughs> That was bitch. Sounds really yeah. Like, yeah. <laughs> hey. So uh, I, I love I love them. Mm -hmm. um, two stories, funny stories. Mm -hmm. um, there was a time when I was growing up, mm -hmm. one of the neighbors talked bad about my my dad. Mm -hmm. You know what my mothers did? They waited for him akitoka kazi, and they beat the hell out of that nigga. Yo, it was like I'm you, the you, gangsters too. You cannot talk about <laughs> our, our husband, husband like this. That is wild. <laughs> And that's okay. Yeah. So mm -hmm. there was a time I made a mistake of uh, sending one money mm -hmm. and, uh, and didn't send to the other. Mm -hmm. I think like, yo, the other one called mm -hmm. and the question she asked is like, am I not your mother? Oh. So this, this so one, now, this you speak to now? You, uh, you spoke to my mom. Okay. Mm -hmm. You spoke to my mom. Oh, mom, me. Oh. Yeah. Or oh, then mom. And mom, then us. It's just, oh, just, mom. It's just, it's just. <laughs> <laughs> Hey. <laughs> so uh, that's 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 the family I'm, yeah. I'm from. It's it's one big um, family. We're yeah. eleven in total, Oof. Uh, and um, eleven siblings. Or 11? yeah, okay. eleven siblings. Yeah. Okay, uh, three sisters. I have three sisters. Mm -hmm. I think I've met and, your, your bro. Don, you're calling the cooler goofy. Yes. Then, <laughs> then uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So <laughs> it's... Oh, really? <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's that's basically yeah. my. Rushed uh, life. That so is you said, unique. did you send the money to the second one now? I had to. Yes, because why? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then now it's, now it's a thing. Now it's a thing. I, I really, like, I, I came from Ethiopia. Mm -hmm. I, I got them some things. Yeah. It has no, to be identical? Not identical, yeah. really. Mm -hmm. But they, the, they same like, yeah, they like the same value. Of the same value. Yeah, of, of, the, like, of, yeah. of the same value. Okay. Yeah, so any time I'm doing something for one, I have to consider for... 
Uh, that is brutal. I've never heard of had this. Do you know any other family that is similar? I've never. Yeah, and this blended. That yeah, is and, wild. and then that blended. Yeah. Yeah, it's it's similar. Uh, the, the Luo community has a lot oh, of that going. Mm. But now the, the thing is um, the, the, the closeness. The, the yeah. togetherness is oh, what now makes it, makes it very different. Mm. Yeah. Did the, did the church play any role in your poetry growing up? A lot. Mm. A lot. I'm an Anglican. Mm. Um, <laughs> <laughs> all saints and gay. Yeah, all saints. I'm, I was an Anglican. Uh, I'm, I'm, <laughs> yeah, okay. I'm an Anglican. Uh, my dad was the one who used to take us to church. Okay. Every Sunday, um, he'd, he'd, he'd prepare us and take us to, to church. Yeah. And the other one thing I need to mention about my family is there are no gender roles as such. Oh, nice. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, when my mom was not there, our dad cooked for us. Wow. Mm. Uh, he took care of us. When our mom was sick, um, he'd leave work, the lunch break come, make sure everything is okay. Mm -hmm. And um, we, we learned how to wash our clothes, cook food, and take care of ourselves yeah. as, um, uh, as, as men. So I think that's also like a very uh, interesting thing. So our sisters really didn't, in a way, like feel the, the oh, I'm part the, of, I'm of, the of, lady. of... I need of, to do this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You need to do that. And um, my mom's had thriving businesses. Yeah. Uh, my mom was running. Balling. So it's it's okay. it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a dope. So when my dad was taking us to to church, mm. um, we had a very good church background. Mm. Sunday school, uh, teenagehood. So it played a big role. So I remember I'm from Nakuru. I remember it was a time I was almost performing to around uh, three thousand congregants. Mm. At a given time. I was still in high school. So that's how I cultivated this poetry yeah. thingy. Mm. I did my first album when I was 17. Ish. Um, went to a certain studio in Nakuru called Efe Records. Mm -hmm. uh, did, recorded. Did you have those digital pieces? No, they're in CDs. Uh -huh. Yeah. They, okay. they, but I have, I have the digital copies. Okay. Uh, okay. And um, I remember I did around 300 copies. And I didn't have money for branding. Mm -hmm. So I bought the CD and I bought a felt pen and wrote all 300 of them goofy. Um, the first one was called Death Row, Son of God. I was still, I was still in the church, yeah. you know. I was still there. <laughs> yeah. Death Row, Son and of God. And the church yeah. congregants bought? It was sold out. Wow. I, I was, I was selling CDs. for… What I was selling Love and how it comes. Yeah, that's loud. That's 2019. Okay. Yeah. I was selling the only CD I have in the house. Yeah. <laughs> Um, oh, that's, yeah, play, that's cause, playable. Because you don't strap it. Oh! Ooh. 15 out of 10. <laughs> <laughs> so the, the, church, the yeah. church played a big role in cultivating yeah. everything I'm doing right now. Mm -hmm. The confidence that I have, uh, the ideas that I have. Because most of the time, you just like start there and mm. do something. Mm. So I remember we started a poetry event in Nakuru mm. that just turned 10 years in April. Ooh. Consistently doing a monthly event in Nakuru for the past 10 years. Yeah. 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 Every month. 500 editions plus. Yes. Yeah. And we have, we have, uh, oh, we have, we have. Every uh, month. <laughs> 50 editions plus. <laughs> no, that's, okay, guys, I'm no, not no. good at math. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, that's, 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 that's going to calculate every week. No, that, that was our 100th wow. our <laughs> edition. Not good at math. 100th edition yes. for 10 years. Mm. That's crazy. And, um, uh, what was I saying? You're just talking about the role of the church. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. So Nakuru, we started that yeah. out from the church. They mm. gave us a venue. Then now before they started like… I'm assuming sound. They give you a venue. Yeah, they give us sound. Yeah. And the audience is there as well. True. Right? The audience is there. The teenagers from Nakuru. Everyone mm. was just… Um, we were a big deal in Nakuru. Okay. Like if I walk in Nakuru, like… Utachoka. <laughs> For real? <laughs> For real. I was a celebrity in Nakuru. Before I moved was to Nairobi. still? Was okay. I, I came to Nairobi now? I'm city boy, I am <laughs> city boy, Nairobi person. Yeah, so um, they gave us venues to try out these events. Mm. We started church ministries, mm. um, going to schools, just spreading the word of poetry, yeah. and um, it played a very, very big role, just like any other artist out there. Yeah, the church, yeah, yeah the church, this keeps always, coming up in conversations. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, when they, did they you slide? Um, when 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 uh, when when they started like um, stifling what we were doing, uh, they wanted to police it so bad. Oh, so um, that it's used as ministry. Yeah, then it it started becoming like becoming another uh, um, scandal. 
Okay. Or the the you know you know art 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 just requires a very calm environment. Yeah. yeah. So if I'm fighting every single day yeah. just to host an event, this is an event that has uh, attracts 350 people yeah. every uh, one Friday in every month. So if I come and find no venue, um, you have not done something. Uh, we need to set up. It's eating up on our time. Yeah. Um, we have to send them what we are trying to talk. And the, 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 big diff, the big fight that I have with churches is people grow and people need to personalize journeys. Yeah. I really just can't be talking about scriptures all through. Yeah, truly. I have to talk about my experiences. Yeah. And as ugly as they are, as they, the they, truth. they need to be yeah, they, they, they need, they to, need be to be they need yeah. to be told, they need to be out there. Yeah. Then you grow up, you travel, you meet people, your your mind and perspective changes. Indeed. And I realize like yo, I have no business hating anyone yeah. just because they don't follow a certain doctrine. Yeah. Yeah. So if I have to conform to that strictly, then it means I don't You're losing your I am, I'm limiting yeah. myself. Yeah. So there's always a verse that has always been with me. It's Ephesians 4.32. It says, Mm-mm. Let be, the Lord say it. Be kind and compassionate <laughs> to one another <laughs> just as Christ was. Mm. And once you read that and then you see what the church is yeah. doing, yeah. it's it's two conflicting things. Yeah, yeah. Okay. They allow politicians to come do their dirty the talk. Yeah. Um, they're very, uh, in a way, corrupt as well. Mm. But they now, touch, yeah, they yeah, 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 and they don't want to talk about these things. Yeah. Uh, they're very silent on, say, corruption, yeah. but they're very... Because they benefit yeah, from yeah. it. They yeah, they, 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 they do. Lot, they, yeah. They, yeah. they do. So, so at some point... Being that safe haven for you. Yeah. At some point, I, I, just, I, just, I just left mm. and uh, decided to, uh, to be out here. Yeah. So basically, yeah. now you, 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 can, know you can pray to me every day. Dear okay. Lord Jaxi. Uh, I, <laughs> and I, I got you. I <laughs> Better than the devil, you know. Yeah, the now, thing, the now thing that's <laughs> <laughs> the thing the church does it it grounds you, yeah. like in, in a way, like yeah. you know your limits. Uh, and probably without the church, I wouldn't be, mm. I wouldn't be where yeah, are, where I am. Mm. So yeah. I'm not I'm not yeah. taking anything away, away from, from them. It, yeah. Yeah. Just that now they need to treat creatives who come through the church better. Yeah, yeah. Um, you, you, you just outgrew the space, bro. Yeah, because you know. um, I, I remember there's a certain church. I'm not going to mention the church because yeah. I also I, I right now I'm a very calm place. I don't want wahala. Mm. Mm. They reached out. We started an open mic mm. show for in them. Nairobi? Yeah, in Nairobi. Mm. And I offered my services mm. uh, for free. With the, uh, they told us that um, for this one they don't have a budget. Yes. They don't do anything. They just like to try out. But for the next one. Mm-hmm. We'll do a budget. So I, I, I went out of my way, mm-hmm. gave them a good structure for a poetry event and all that. Mm-hmm. Then next, the following year, problems. They are like, oh, we don't have a budget. Uh, nini, nini, nah, nini. Nah. So this is this is where this is where now like I got pissed. Mm-hmm. Yeah, a friend of ours were, were doing ministries mm-hmm. around uh, Kenya, mm-hmm. so they were looking for churches to host the events. Mm-hmm. They are beatboxers, rappers, and poets. Mm-hmm. Do you know what the church told them? Mm-hmm. They have to pay. They have to pay. Huh? And For this, this is yeah, yeah. This is one of the people who I talked to come and perform during For the free. first uh, setup event. Wow. So th- that was my last stroke. I was like, why yeah, am I? Ever. Why yeah, am I here? Yeah. And I'm, I'm still, I'm still struggling to make things work. Yeah. But you on your end. It's like Literally. it's, it's, like you're it's doing business. Me a favor. Yeah, it's yeah. business as usual yeah. for you. So okay. I, I, I just. I just left. But the church needs to take care of its creatives. Yeah. Um, I might not be a staunch Christian right now, mm. but I know there are very creative people uh, in church mm. who need that, that, um, that spring and that uh, hand-holding. Yeah. Ilya, for real, it's not like ulterior motives. Mm. Yeah. If you're a rapper, they're, they're there with you. Yeah. They're coming for your shows. They're yeah. funding you or they're just supporting so you. Really they're really plugging really. you, you know. Yeah. Because they have the they have the capacity, they have mm-hmm. the systems, they have the channels to to do that. Okay. So yeah. To I, the churches. Congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> I saw you, you waiting. I mean, she could have Yeah, so yeah. lastly from my end. Okay. Ogopa or Kalif? Oh yo, 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 yo. Let me tell you. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. <laughs> I'm 50-50. Okay. And here's why. Mm-hmm. Khalif had their run. Especially if, if you're a filmmaker like mm-hmm. 
Oh, the storytelling. Caliph like TV. shifted that whole thing yeah. of telling stories in, in using their 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 music, visuals, yeah. their, their their visuals. Yeah. Ogopa, Ogopa were the were the more uh, dominant uh, um, stable because yeah. I think of finances and resources mm. uh-huh. as much as and talent too, bro. Yeah, and talent massive. Bro. But I'm leaning towards. Um, yeah. Ogopa. Mm-hmm. I'm leaning towards Ogopa because for them it was it was hits after, after hits. Yeah, so after Ogopa. Hits, after Banner. hits, after hits, after hits. Yeah, but shout out to, to Kali. Shout out to Juakali. <laughs> yeah. Shout out to Juakali. Because oh. I think I think Juakali was the one who like really, really propelled yep. Nonini, yeah. Juakali. Yeah. Damn, uh, you wish we should do Legends edition <laughs> maybe in July. True, that would be right? dope. Yeah, we just have legends every week. Kali for Gopa. I'm biased, bro. I'm Caliph, man. Caliph or Gopa? <laughs> or Gopa. Or Gopa. Or Gopa yeah. gave us hits. Yeah. So, hits. man, shout out to Akina... Um, craft concept. Akina Craft, craft concept, yeah. right? Yeah. So that they did really cool. Caliph versus Or Gopa on Thursday. Yeah. And it was live bands. Yeah. So Mutora represented Or Gopa. And Charisma represented Caliph. Caliph. Of course I was. Of course I was there. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Me, I'm Timo Gopa. Of course. Okay, shout out to Caliph. Of course, I, I love Caliph, bro. Yeah. I love Caliph. Yeah. Yeah. Shout out to Clemo. Nah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I have to be biased to the pod, but... <laughs> ah, sorry. Yeah, shout out to Clemo. I was with Clemo yeah. maybe three weeks ago. Yeah. Shout out to whatever Caliph did. You know what I mean? But then... And I listened to all of them. But if I was to pick one, me, I'm Timo Gopa. Yeah. Straight up. Yeah. So, yeah. Timo Gopa, to Menda Wuko na Kierehere... <laughs> we tuna jua too. This is this is easy, yeah, yeah. you know. So one, you have Mutoria programming ah, music. Yes. Yes. <laughs> but on, on the other hand, of course, you have, you have charisma, charisma. Yeah. charisma and the jukebox yeah. stage presence, bro. But you know what Madness. I mean? Anyway, so round one, uh, round one, me I know to machine, but mm. round one is a bit tricky. Round one is like 50-50. It's bangers, bangers. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Round two, I'm like, sister, what else is charisma going to come back? Mm-hmm. Round three, mm-hmm. your time. I've not had a single Red Sun song. Mm-hmm. I've not had a single Nameless song. Ooh. I've not had a Wahoo tattoo? song. I've not had Tattoo. So I've know. not had uh, Nani, Big Pin. So Mimi... You have bullets in the chair. Mimi, I'm just like, hey! To ready. To ready. Anyway, mm-hmm. I can charisma feel like they were, they were rigged. There was no rigging. Mm. There was no... You were there, remember? Bro, it was... Wait, charisma was Caliph. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Let me tell you something about Charisma. Charisma is the sorest loser I know. <laughs> <laughs> Man- yeah! Man- Manchester United losing team. That's a problem. Charisma posted a selfie like this today. Lakers, Lakers <laughs> losing team. Yeah. I'm sure he's, he's a Mercedes fan. <laughs> so, looks like one, I'm calling yeah. Charisma and Mutori as we, as we finish this okay. conversation. And I'm calling Mutora to congratulate him and Charisma to give him gun. Nah. gun <laughs> Just shoot him and end the call. Yeah, that's the call. <laughs> but, oh, let's add them on one call. Yes. That would be really right? good. Right? Yes. Joe, pick up. You just called me. So, bro, uh, so the, the, they're yeah, saying... He, there's another... he might be busy working on my album. So... No. Oh, go, 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 <laughs> 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 so you're live on the podcast. There's the three of us, and then oh, I'm live on the podcast. Oh, yes. Yes. Oh, oh, finally. oh my god! Oh, <laughs> okay, <laughs> so extra. I listen to myself. Yeah, okay, our guest hey, producing his album. I hope like your life, your life has changed. So, Goofy is here. Hey, we're going Goofy Dogs. Oh, what's up, what's up? We're going to be in a motor. No, 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 no. Sasa, quick one. I want to add charisma on this call. So, don't hang up. Ah, yeah. Because, Babu, what's up? My friend and me. What's up? 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 Caliph. Too many bangers, yeah. bro. Because yeah. if, if you look at it, Caliph was revolving around just very specific. Yeah, yeah. Just, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Specific. yeah. But even, even with Ogopa, they didn't even sing Ratata or something. But they had, no, all no, of no, them were just even with Ogopa, they had even come out of what you can call one hit wonders. Wing it, one of the big songs. Yo. Yo. One, you're live on the podcast, Mutora is on the call as well. Now, bigger guns, 
Wait, how am I talking <laughs> with this loser? <laughs> no, 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 uh, that's why I'm asking. Why am I being called by thieves? <laughs> Which thieves? Aliba, you're like when people when people get those calls from Kavit. <laughs> wow. You know you know why I'm saying charisma is a sore loser. Yeah. We went to this craft the 60 concept uh-huh. yeah. like singing games all those games. Mm. We beat oh, his yeah, group. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Bado alisema tumeiba. Mbaka alivunjika mgongo. Alivunjika. Oh, oh, oh. Acha sasa. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Oni goofy. Oni nani anaongea? Oni goofy. Oni goofy. Ah, ya goofy nilimwambia tuli lose jo mimi nilivunjika nikaenda. Ah, wow. Sasa goofy. Tulifika kwa finals na goofy na sikuwa. Goofy is an Arsenal fan. You expect him to win when a United fan. I have a question for the two of you. Where, where are we assuming Goofy is the winner? <laughs> <laughs> But you 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 you're the most Goofy recent loser. Akishindo has a match with Nikubiwa. Uh-huh. Ni mazoea. Ni mazoea. Ni mazoea. Ni mazoea. Like I'm a, <laughs> charisma charisma is the baba of music. <laughs> <laughs> Najua ni wote ni wote mnataka kujiasiti na mimi ni sawa. Unaeleweka. Pole rao. You need me in your story. I have a question. I have a question, right? So when when you get this call for doing Ogopa versus Kalif, uh yeah. do you get called and you're told Charisma you're doing Kalif, uh Mutora you're doing Ogopa or you are you think? given an option to choose? No, so this this event was our event, yeah. Mm. Um So Mutore and I while we were doing Wazi Wazi last year we we did uh, like an activation at a certain club yeah mm. and then we did like a thing where we played a bunch of Kenyan songs and guys really loved it so we were like um, we talked up and I was like bro to funny stuff no na kan kitu wasio na like um yeah alafu to decide to um i think Mutore alipogopa kwa sababu Kalif ni ngumu <laughs> What are you saying about Mutoria? <laughs> no backwood. <laughs> no, but honestly, but honestly, it literally just came from us guys wanting uh, realizing that people have that kind of effort and people yeah, yeah. do this kind of gig but in a kwanga DJ. Mm. So like we can give a proper proper uh, different okay. experience. Yeah. Nice. Bro, like I, yeah. I'm not, I'm not going to lie, like I was mm. super proud of you guys. Uh, I came backstage of course Mutoria alikuwa hapo all kume hapa already to so identify find you of course, of course even even after after, 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 after we won our game alihapa alihapa so nilikuwa nimekewa nilikuwa nimekewa lounge ya msanii view Mutoria alikata kuja we kwenda na ilikuwa backstage busy gloating and so I'm I'm super proud of you guys but I think one of uh, one of the highlights of the night is when mm. you guys did wake up by nonini and called me to down stage we. then kama kianza mkaanza ngoma then mkanyamaza mkampatia mic ni kwa zile za tunaweza imba nonini atufunge acha acha ongeze kwa bill yako we was mutinda aware that is coming on stage was mutinda aware he was coming on stage No, he wasn't aware. So like we, oh, we, that was Yeah, it. we kind of had the I mean, um I think to Lijo watakuwa. So tulianza tulikuwa tumeipanga time ya set yetu tukasema sasa tutamtinda kwa audience. Tumwambia kwa stage yetu kiape. Yeah, easy. Uh, are, we, are we getting another one? Are we getting around two? Cuz Mutoria, Mutoria wanna get around two. I want in. Mutoria, mimi nilikuwa hivi. Nataka to confirm. Eh. Around two ya ku confirm mama. Mimi niko like Me I want to hear my red sun. There's so many I, to, I, I only had one Easter truly. song. I had one nameless song. I barely <laughs> had red sun. I didn't hear Wahoo. I didn't hear Big Bill. Yeah, totally. The plan actually is to do a tour. Ooh. Mm. So nice. that's what we're discussing me, right now. I, I've been working out I can carry speakers. <laughs> 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 nice. So want to do it bigger and better. Of course yeah. there are things that uh, happen to me. Uh, to Melan sasa sasa hivi tutaenda next time yeah. mm. um so sasa hivi sasa tukie aza kupanga hiyo tu vizuri mm. i think in a shape even even yeah. better nice. even set list so that charisma to be all through nita ku enroll sasa please yeah, i think that would be dope please tufanye mm mm-hmm. tu, eh tufanye moja ya, ya kuamaliza vizuri najua tulikuwa mm-hmm. tulikuwa we wapo like um, sisi yeah, and then, and then also i think the thing about this idea is it's a really super idea but it's it's not an easy idea to like reinvent 
you know, mm-hmm. um, because what do you do the next time? Because when you're doing it again, you don't want to do a Cali versus a Gopa. So we're also like thinking outside the box with how we can we can do this event and make it like really dope every single time that mm-hmm. we do it, you know, so that mm-hmm. next time we can come chat, yeah. we feel kind of kid when you want to before. Yeah. Uh, we do ah, I have some I have some ideas I hit you up. Because the, the, the yeah, only please do. the only thing that I want is to remain constant yeah. is, is watching you lose. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, Goofy, you can keep watching us and all. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you get a cost of losing. No, I, I, I watched you yesterday. <laughs> Listen. Yeah, but anyway, yeah. Another thing, I think just another thing on my end is just working with um, brilliant people, the likes of Mutoria, yeah. Kibuja, uh, Slayo. It's just like we've been feeding off each other's energy and being able to create something that a lot of people wouldn't even have thought about. Mm. So like to me, to me, to, to me realize strength there too, mm. especially Mutoria and I, because Mutoria and I have worked together <laughs> before. Kina Kibuja wame to change Mbaya. Manze, Mimi, Kibuja wame to change Mbaya. Coming yeah. next time, me miss me the Google logistics attack. Mm. <laughs> yeah. 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 Mutoria, yeah. unakuja, usijali, uko juu, usijali. No, umesha kupanga. I don't know what to myself. Listen to this podcast in the future. I don't know what to plug. I'm drop next Sunday. Niko na wewe, niko na wewe, bro. What's the guy? Ah, bless you guys. Oh, bless you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think that's a good point. Honestly, yes, we've been yeah, rolling yeah. two hours. I'm not doing it. 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 Of course not. Uh, Viva la street, bro. What do you mean? Ngumoja ko inange ngine nyumbani. Hey. Unajua unajua the good thing TD I like Swahili. So good thing by seven Swahili. Ah, okay. Uh, okay. Uh, anyway, listen okay. guys. Uh-huh. Show show up and show out on 24th of June if you yes. haven't bought no, if you haven't bought tickets 25th is still open. Mm. Yeah. Uh, if you need my ticket for Saturday, kindly hit me up in the DM. Hola. And um all the best. Can't wait to see what you have in store for us. Thank Love you. you appreciate you. Welcome back on Mike Check again. Thank you very much for hosting me. See you on the 24th and 25th. Yes sir. Yes, sir. Episode 68. We are Mike Check. Over 26. <laughs> this is the This is the Brunch Club. Over 26. Now when you watch it you'll understand <laughs>